I want to give a huge thank you to uh, the creators of these mods or, or, or the, the map randomizer, the universal map randomizer that we have being developed. Um, I want to give a huge thank you to at sign turtle Isaac and X Luma, uh, for creating, uh, this mod, uh, taking the time out, uh, accepting the commission and, uh, really putting all of their blood, sweat, and tears into, uh, something like this, not only for, you know, content for you guys to enjoy and all this stuff, but also making it, uh, in a way that you can play it yourself. Uh, so shout outs to them. Thank you so much. And let's get into it. Pokemon Platinum, except the entire map is randomized. I'll put a little timer on the bottom right so you can see how long it's going to last. Um, or it's going to take us, but... <laughs> get ready. This brings back uh, memories as well. Renoa, thanks for the tier one. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> How's the sound too? Is it good? Is it bad? Uh, Bangs McGee, thanks for three months. Also, uh, some of you guys are probably wondering when this is going to release for public. Uh, it will release when I get the video out. When I have a good video and everything, and I put the video on YouTube, when you see that video drop on YouTube, it's going to be available for free for you to play yourself. All right, Pokemon Platinum version. All right. <laughs> Hopefully this uh, this goes well. Hello there. It's so very nice to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Oh my God, it's Professor Rowan. Everyone just calls me the Pokemon Professor. Oh my God, I love it. Right. <laughs> um, I uh, I haven't played Platinum in a while. Uh, and we're gonna be playing. By the way, we're gonna be playing uh, Shining Pearl uh, on Friday. If you um play Brilliant Diamond, you're dead to me. Oh, <laughs> I'm like, wow, it's not, it's not. <laughs> Sorry, we have to press the Pokeball, my bad. <laughs> uh, Frecky, thanks for the 19 months. Cooper came with 100 bits. And Hyrule Dad, thanks for the six months. Chess Damon, thanks for the tier one subscription. Uh, time for Grill's next adventure. The 12 year old with cat ears. Um, what a, what a weird persona we've, we've created. <laughs> what an absolute weird persona. All right. Tell me, what is your name? Chat, you probably already know it by now. But what is our name? Ah, yes. The age-old adventure that transcends time and space. Grill. Your name is Grill? Yes, because she is one. <laughs> Baba Yoda, thanks for the prime. And uh, Slavo you, thanks for the 18 months. Uh, Thought Wheels with the prime gaming. Thank you. So, your grill? Fine name! Alright. Um, now, this boy. Oh, what did we name the boy? I think it's just boy, right? Isn't it boy? It's been a while since we were able to name our rival. Because they stopped that, yeah. It's grill and boy. Boy, is it? That's your friend's name? It is. Look at him go. Yeah, because like in the recent games, they they uh, don't allow you to name your own rival. Right? Because because I think it was starting Gen 5. You have Charon and, and Bianca. You're not allowed to name them. And then you get like X and Y, I don't know. And then you get Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, which I also don't know. Or that one's Hop? No, Hop is Sword and Shield. Pokemon by our side. All right, all right. I'm going to speed through this real quick. All right, there we go. <laughs> that concludes our special program. Oh, I'm so excited. Dude, I'm so excited to see this in, uh, in, in on the Switch and everything. I, I can't wait. There you are. What's up, boy? All right, I'm going to speed through a little bit of this at least. Um, I was also told to check the PC. <laughs> I was told to check the PC before uh, before we start on our adventure. There's a message. <laughs> Dear Eric, I hope you are ready for this. This is the product of over 60 combined hours of hard work. Turtle Isaac at sign at Xluma. Oh! <laughs> hey, 
Thanks. P.S. Give him hell, chat. <laughs> oh my. Do I do I have the best modders or what? Oh my god. Wait, that's so wholesome. <laughs> Wait, I love that. I love that so much. <laughs> Oh my god, shoutouts to Isaac, uh, X Luma, and that side. I don't know what's about, but he sure was in a hurry. <laughs> Those wide people happy, dude. Look, it's my mom. Hi, mom. Holy 60 hours? I actually thought it was a little bit more than that. I would, I would be surprised if... It, I was surprised it was that low. That shows how, uh, insane they are at this. All right, we don't have our own Pokemon. Take care, sweetie. All that fun stuff. Mom! All right, what ch we got to choose what what starter we get as well, don't we? Because I forget how this starts, right? Like, we have to go up here. Codename, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Hi, Grill. Boy was looking for you, right? Let's go check it out. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna speed up the game too too much at the very beginning because I want to experience this like for the first time that we're doing it. Um, there seems to be some tearing on the screen too, but that's probably fine, right? Thud! I always I always loved when they put the thud there because I was like, whoa, it's so cool! They've done dynamic text. It was like the coolest thing when I was younger. I was like, wow, they're really like taking this game seriously. Plus, all the graphics are amazing. To be fair, they are really good, but, you know. Zio, thanks for the two months. Oh, we have to go talk to him. Whoopsies. You know, maybe I should actually listen. Like, small thought. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I think uh, Gen 4 is one of my favorite, uh, favorite games. I'd have to say that. Well, let's see. Uh, let's see about the map randomizer. Cause if you're if you're curious, Twin Leaf is not randomized. Uh, because you know we'll get like soft locked, you know, <laughs> uh, like immediately. Uh, so we need to get our our starter Pokemon because we don't have any Pokemon. Um, so that's why we're uh, that's why this right now is fine. Too slow. All right, let's get moving. Uh, don't go into the grass, right? No worries. No problem. It doesn't matter what we have. Any Pokemon? Trust me on this one. I have an idea. Right. Um... Okay. On your marks, hold it! <laughs> I will say, I, I got Turtwig when I first played this game. Turtwig uh, was uh, my Pokemon Diamond, which is the one I had. My sister had Pokemon Pearl. Uh, I chose Turtwig. She chose Piplup. I think, arguably, Piplup is the better starter. If you're doing, like, a challenge or anything. You two. You truly love Pokemon, do you? Yes. Whoa, hold up. You're not making any sense here. Damn. All right. Didn't quite catch that, so I'll ask you again. No, I, I don't like Pokemon. <laughs> um, I didn't quite catch that. So I'll ask you again. No, man, I don't, I don't. All right, fine, fine, fine. We do like Pokemon. The illusion of choice. Now, I feel like you guys, you know, whenever I ask you, hey, should we do this or that? I always have the answer already in my head, but I like to ask you guys. So it looks like you guys have a choice in the matter. <laughs> what, you can ask a hundred times. The answer will never change. Yeah. Oh, well, we'll both answer 100 times. We love Pokemon. Yep, 100%. Right, Grill? No. That joke's getting old. <laughs> Wait, I've never answered no on this. <laughs> oh, a pair of breakfast kids who foolishly try to enter tall grass on their own. It worries me. All that fun stuff. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. We'll get through it. We'll get through it. Uh, all right. So we now need to do his briefcase. Professor Rowan. Oh my, wait, I forgot that, um, was it Lucas? Yeah, I forgot that, like, the, the other, your, the other characters in the game. I, I, I don't know. I don't know why. 
Oh, the bop though. Thought Wheel, thanks for the 1,000 bits. Fluffy Cake, thanks for the tier one. Alex Reccio, thanks for the tier one. And Toothless, Axolotl, thanks for the five months. All right. All right, briefcase. Briefcase. Chat, which one do we choose? We have three options. Uh, we have uh, Turtwig. We have Chimchar, and we have Piplup. Now imagine if one of these was was a shiny. That would be insane. <laughs> Take all of them. I don't think that's an option. Um, I chose Turtwig as my first starter. Chimchar is one of the few fire type Pokemon in Sinnoh, and Piplup. Well, Piplup's damn cute. Uh, the thing about it <laughs> is, uh, you can vote in the poll. Here, there's a poll. There's poll in chat. Vote, vote in the poll. And uh, and then you guys can uh, choose which starter we ch we get. We either do uh, grass thing, amazing. We do chimchar, amazing. Or we do piplup, amazing. All right, you got like 30 seconds left on the poll. Let me see if we can uh, show the poll right now. For those who don't have Twitch. Oh. All right, choose the starter. Choose the starter. <laughs> well, it looks like Piplup won the poll. All right, we'll choose Piplup then. It's not like I was going to pick Piplup regardless of the, the poll, but you know what? You guys won anyways, so. <laughs> then I choose you. I'm picking this Turtwig. Right, right, right. I was going to pick Piplup anyways, because it, cause it can learn Surf. <laughs> uh, <that> was, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's, like, pretty helpful. So I think, like, when you do a map randomizer, I think uh, choosing the water type starter is like the best one to do it right job thanks for the tier one and Talay, thanks for the 18 months nix bar thanks for the five months all right grill we both got pokemon now there's only one thing we do right are you up for this no what's with that attitude don't be that way all right fine all right i, I feel like we're being strung along this pokemon journey without our consent yeah, I feel like they're literally like, yeah, you're going on this Pokemon journey, like, regardless if you want it or not. Oh, we're in a fight. <laughs> oh, I forgot that he just fights you off the bat. All right, watch this insane strategy that we have against uh, our rival boy, right? So we have a couple options here. Uh, Turtwig, normally a slower type Pokemon to our comparative Piplup. However, we have the type disadvantage. We only know two moves. Turtwig also only knows two moves. I believe it's Leer and also Tackle, which doesn't do much in the grand scheme of things right because that means type advantages do not actually matter so we're going to use a pound instantly does a little bit amount of his damage uh about like i want to say one six he does a withdraw actually he doesn't know leer he knows withdraw which increases his defense therefore we're fucked uh yeah we're just gonna keep using pound We're also actually, I feel he's just using withdraw here. Um, and we're not going to lose this because, you know, we're good at Pokemon. So, <laughs> obviously, look at that. And our Piplup gained 67, just shy of the magic number. All right, let's go home. I'm beat after that battle. My Pokemon needs rest too. See you, Grill. Bye, boy. Light Ray, thanks for the Prime Gaming. All right, we're going to say bye to Mom. All right, chat. I'll say bye to Mom. Say bye to Mom. I'll miss you, Mom. And we got a pair of running shoes. I always love how they uh, give us running shoes. Uh, at the very beginning of, uh, of the adventures now. Okay, awesome. So, now we begin our randomizer. Well, actually, I think we go to the... 
I think we have to go to Sand Gamers, right? Uh, yeah, legendary Pokemon lives there. Let's get to that Pokemon. They'll make Professor Roan happy. Oh, right, right. I forgot how long the intro is for this. Uh, yeah, I'm going to battle tons. Yeah, okay. Oh, and we have to go to, like, uh, Verity. I forgot that we actually have to do this. Sparacy, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you guys so much for all your Primes. I used mine today because I was in Linkus' stream. And uh, someone said Prime Gaming in his chat, and it reminded me. All right, get ready, because we're capturing that legendary Pokemon. Yeah, the, the intro is long. I, I apologize. Um, I will speed it up a little bit, though. Gatsby, thanks for the 400 bits. But yeah, um, there we go. Okay. The screen Terry makes me think I'm watching an old-timey movie. I don't know how to fix it, but it's probably fine. All right. Verity Lakefront. All right. So that's uh, unrandomized, but I feel like if we get to Sangam Town immediately, that's going to be... Uh, not randomized as well. Ten rings. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Hey, Epo Man. Thanks for the Tier 1. And Rouser, thanks for the Prime. That wasn't like a full plug, but you know what? We'll take it. All right. Let's see if it works. Oh, well, we have to do this first. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I'm waiting for you. Please come with me. The professor's waiting to see you. Right. And I'm assuming this also isn't randomized. Yeah. Thud! So much plot! Peanut Pitch, thanks for the eight months. Villa Fleur, thanks for the Prime Gaming. And Caspi, thanks for the Tier 1. Thanks for all the subs, guys. All right, let's go in. All that fun stuff. I'm going to speed this up for you guys. All right, because you're going to give us the uh, Pokedex. I mean, as long as, like, you know, like, I, I see the comparison made in chat right now of this intro. At least it's not in Xenoblade Chronicles 2, where the, the, the tutorial actually goes on for about, like, eight, ten hours. That's not a joke. That's actually, that's how it works. And you still get tutorial messages halfway through the game. Awesome, Alec. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Random Orange Cloud. Thanks for four months. Let me ask you again, Grill. I want to entrust you with this Pokedex. Will you use it to record data on all the Pokemon in Sinnoh for me? No. I can stand here without speaking for hours. I'm a very patient man. Let me ask you again, Grill. <laughs> okay. All right, we'll go in. <laughs> Good answer. All right, we got the Pokedex. I guess, I guess, man, they really don't want us to, to say no. All right. Uh, what'd you feel, blah, 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 all that fun stuff. Your grand adventure begins now, after a few short messages from our sponsor. All right. Uh, wait one second. I need to go to... Enable anti-aliasing. All right, we got TM27, nice. What does this do again? Oh, I think this is a. Uh, um, it's not. It's not return, but it's like, it's like the one that gets powerful the more friendship you have. Return. That's what it is. Right, and it's single use. Right. Speaking. Speaking of a uh, uh, single use. Um. <laughs> uh. Sp right. Speaking of single use, if I recall, BDSP, like Shining Pearl, Brilliant Diamond, also has exclusively single-use TMs. Single-use, unlike your mom. <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, fuck! Oh! My mom is a lovely person, okay? Jesus! Evalian, thanks for the two gifted subs. Alpha Phoenix Burb, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Oh, I can't fix the tearing. Okay, that's fine. Um, all right. Um, let me go up here. Is the tearing like too, is, is it too bad for you guys? 
Or is it like fine? Uh, wait. Why don't you go tell your family the professor asked you for help? Right. I, I need to go to talk to mom again. It's fine. All right. I just wanted to double check. It's, it's not going to like hurt the stream or anything. I'm not going to restart. I was just curious. All right. So we got to talk to mom again. Guys, say hi to mom in a second. What's up, mom? Wow. Professor Rowan asked you to do something that big. That's crazy. We got a journal, all that stuff. It's just a, it's a... What is a journal except for a... A, a man diary? <laughs> that's... That's... That's what we call it, right? <laughs> Alright, I'm told I need to save the game. Right now. Okay, parcel, all that fun stuff, Jubilife Life City. Okay. Okay. So game has been saved. All right. Now I think we kind of start. I think this is where we start the the randomize. The randomizer basically. Uh Trucker Chick, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Uh Drag Meyer Fern, thanks for the gifted sub. And Billy, thanks for the two gifted. All right. All right, so let's check this out. So this is the this is the Pogo Lab, right? Right, which isn't anything. I want to make sure. Okay. <laughs> so now we have the PC. <laughs> oh, let's get randomizing! <laughs> oh boy! Oh boy! Okay, 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 okay. So I actually have uh, something prepared here, right? Um, I'm more prepared than the first time. Uh, I will show you guys this. Uh, I spent a couple hours last night making this. Um, so I'd have a little bit of organization, uh, when we do this as well. Right? And I'll, I'll show you guys with this. I know, it's... I know, I... It's not MS Paint. I apologize. I, I really apologize. Let me also turn on the AC. Oh, wait, there's a surprise. Hi. Um, I didn't realize they were here, but say hello. Uh, real quick. Say hello. That's Nance. These are my, Hi. these are my mods. <laughs> All of them. Yeah. So <laughs> Nance and Julia. So that's laxative titties, right? <laughs> In person. I don't know who, the, I'm not sure who that one is, but. <laughs> yeah. And then there's Abby, right? So say hi. Hello. Hi. <laughs> So is there anything you'd like to tell my chat while you're here? Laxative titties is fine, but laxative shitties is too far. Yep. <laughs> so, um, so call it laxative wise titties, words. not laxative <laughs> shitties. That's what it is, right? And then do you have anything you want to say? I was just going to say everyone be nice and have fun today, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> a tad different. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. I have something to say. If Eric makes me order Chipotle one more time and then doesn't eat it, I'm gonna quit. <laughs> right. Bet? <laughs> Are you gonna? I mean, I have it right here. Like, mostly, right? It's, no, it's, it's, it's a good yeah, chunk. Mostly, yeah, it's, it's a good like, chunk. Out. Yeah, that's that's like my breakfast and everything. So, yeah, the mods are actual people. Yeah, that's true. I'm yeah. a bot. Yeah. <laughs> I, we're, we're paid actors, but we are real. Yeah. But we're not paid. Not paid. <laughs> we're unpaid actors. You're Not unpaid employee. actor. Yeah, we don't use. We don't the... use the word employee. Yeah, we. Whoa, whoa, whoa. we don't use that word. <laughs> whoever, whoever said I'm very gay right now? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, employee in, it implies that I have to pay you health insurance. So. Yeah, no, no benefit. <laughs> the only the benefit is friendship. And we all know yeah. Eric doesn't no, no, care no, about our friendship. Well. All right. Friendship. Yeah. Doesn't... Anyway. Friendship. <laughs> 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 all right. I know these guys are, are are itching to get to the phone. Yeah, absolutely. So. Enjoy yeah. Your bye. 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 Say bye. 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 Bye.
Anyways, yeah, uh, uh, Julia and Nance were uh, visiting, so uh, they wanted to say hi. Uh, <laughs> so pretty cool. Sorry, uh, I know you guys want to get to a randomizer, but um, that means more to me than any uh, video game would ever. Uh, so, all right, so lab is uh, unchanged, right? Uh, so lab is unchanged. So the PC goes to turn back cave. I don't know where turn back cave is, though. Marlo, thanks for the 50 gifted subs. Holy shit. That is insane. Holy crap. Thank you so much for that. That, that is above and beyond and absolutely amazing of you. Thank you. All right, let's check out what the Pokemart does. Yeah, 50 gifted. That's $250. Okay, so the... Okay, so... The... <laughs> so, <laughs> once again, this is a beta test. <laughs> once again, this is a beta test, which is important that we saved, right? So it's it's totally cool. Glad we did it. <laughs> So for the uh, Pokemart, I'll just write a resounding, don't go in, right? <laughs> that sounds good, right? <laughs> oh my God. All right, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, once again, thanks for the 50 gifts. Just label it void, void. void. This is a beta. That, this is why it's not like available for you guys to play yet. Because we still need to work out some of the kinks, obviously. Like this. Can we get Bedoof as an HM slave? Whoa! 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 We, we use HM forcibly unpaid labor. Thank you. <laughs> you calm down there. It's an HM employee without health insurance benefits or payment. <laughs> HM volunteer, <laughs> HM indentured servant. Thank you. So small house goes to Mount Cornet. Okay. Oh wait, we we probably block out here, right? If if we encounter a Pokemon. Yeah, 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 for sure. So let me write this down. So small house is Mount Cornet. Um, I'm gonna. Do we have Pokeballs? No. No, so we're 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 just so we're just dead. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, okay, cool. So this is Galactic HQ, and this brings us to Jubilife. Is this Jubilife? I forget what this is. This is, this is like a house. Oh, it's heart home. Heart home. Um. Okay. So so the 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 elevator doesn't do anything here. Good to know. Arky, thanks for the seven months. It's important that we're playing this now before we race it too. Yeah, I love Gen Four so much. Uh. Also, uh, Zoe. <laughs> By the way, you're not gonna be editing this video, but you're gonna be editing the race. Uh, that I do. I just wanna. Put that out there in case you were curious on, on which one you were editing. <laughs> Who will the race be against? I have I have asked Purple Cliff. Uh, if he's not available, I have um, some other people in mind. <laughs> okay, okay, nice. <laughs> nice. All right, uh, so what's down here? Dude, there's so many warps. <laughs> Dude, there's so many warps! Literally! Uh... Okay. We're back in Rocket HQ with not the key. Oh my god, this is insane. Okay, so if we go down here... Oh, we, we found the first gym! Uh... Okay, gym number one found. I re I realize I haven't I haven't like told you guys what the goal of this is, but the goal of it is to beat all eight gyms and all four elite four members in order. That is the goal, right? So so we need to we need to beat them in order. I, I realize I just like I was like all right. I'm assuming you guys all know what we're doing right now. So we found gym number one, which is actually insane. Uh, so I'll be like gym one. I can't beat gym one currently. If that's like not obvious. 
Uh, I mean, we can try, though. What do you mean, full set? Ah, oh, we're doing it. Yo, is that the one? The only amazing Link of Seven. Thanks for the raid party of 620. Doing a randomizer of your own. You guys don't know, uh, Link is... We're dead. We're definitely dead. Um, uh, Linkus was playing uh, the Ocarina of Time 3DS randomizer. <laughs> uh, we're dead. <laughs> we're so dead. Yeah, yeah, I forgot. We don't have water moves yet. Liz, thanks for the 18 months. Appreciate it. Yeah, this isn't going to go well. I'll be real with you guys. Dakota, thanks for the 13 months. Hey, if you're not following Linkus already and you're coming from his stream, uh, give him a follow. He's pretty cool. He's pretty awesome. Um, I like his content. I think he's a pretty swell lad. And if you're not following me, well... That's cool. <laughs> Nuzlocke map randomizer one? Dude, you are, you are free to take that idea. There is no shot I'm doing that. There's literally no shot. Oh, there, she's explained to me what hit points are because I died. Okay, nice. Okay, because I died on the first... I didn't realize she does that. If you die before you get to a Pokemon Center, you revive at Mom, right? But then she tells you what hit points are. Because I guess the developers were assuming you don't know what hit points are if you die without seeing a reaching a Pokemon Center. That's so funny. I didn't realize that. Full-on randomizer with both map and Pokemon. That might be in the works. But Dakota thinks the 13. I don't know if I said it before. But yeah, I'm going to get Pokeballs. That's that's what we need to do. We need to get Pokeballs because we haven't yet. Uh, so we need Lucas to teach us. There we go. Dude, I can't wait for, for Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. That's going to be insane. That's going to be so much fun. Anyone else excited for Legends of Arceus where Nuzlocke can end and you're self-dying? Right, because in Legends of Arceus, that's kind of how that works. You literally faint yourself. Yeah, that's going to be cool. <laughs> if you die in game, you die in real life. Wait, no. Wait. Keep Steve's. Thanks for the 21 months. Okay. So, let's... So, we got our... We got Pokemon... We got Pokeballs, right? We have Bag... Um, Pokeballs. All right, so we have five Pokeballs. Um, let's go. We did, okay, so small house leads to gym one. Okay, so let's go to gym, let's go to big house. Oh, the old chateau. You know, the issue I think I currently have, I think the issue we currently have um, with all of this is, here, let me, uh, let me do this so you can see it. Um, uh, the issue I have with all of this is, uh, I opened up Photoshop first, is that we don't have a, like a high level Pokemon. So I think the, the goal right now is to level up our Piplup Atad. Although we don't have a Pokemon Center, which is also kind of Monka W. Because we don't, because we can't heal our Pokemon. There's no Pokemon Center nearby. Webcats, thanks for the two months. Balance leads to so many things. It's not just gym one. I'm very loosely doing this. So all of my notes are very loose because um, it's not like a race, right? We haven't like solved the game. Like like Emerald, right? So I have a I have a spreadsheet of everywhere that Emerald can lead us and everything that we know with Emerald. This, I, I haven't played Platinum in a while. So I am, if you want, if you want, you can backseat uh, if you need to help me with warps and everything. Or like where things lead. I'm okay with that. That that is that is fine with me. No, I, I also know that if you talk to mom, she'll she'll heal you up, right? So literally right here. Um but yeah. Yeah, you should go to the Pokemon Center. Yeah. You know what? I haven't thought about that. Maybe if I go to the Pokemon Center I can heal up. <laughs> Oh my god. Platinum uh, release date. So this will be released when it's done. Um, 
I will say when the YouTube video about this randomizer is done and uploaded on my channel, that's when it'll be available for you guys. It'll be after uh, Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl is released. <laughs> yeah, bro, just just heal at the Pokemon Center. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Good idea. Good idea. I'll just heal at the Pokemon Center. Just easy. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Uh, I need to go out that way. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Poodles can do the links to the gifted sub. Okay, uh, I found another bug. <laughs> I found it. I found another bug. <laughs> it's just, just a small, small bug there. <laughs> hey, they must have remodeled the game. <laughs> Guys, it's missing though. The catastrophe. Shout outs to the shout outs to the, the shout outs to the one the ones who uh know the catastrophe. No thanks with Prime Gaming. Oh, I should just bubble. What am I doing? Oh I'm dead. I'm I'm alive. I'm alive. We somehow got alive. It's not, yeah, it's not a bug, it's a feature. Whoa! Yo, we're on one HP, let's go. All right, the goal is to get a little bit leveled higher and then we'll go to gym one, actually. Nix, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Yo, Shinx. The Pokemon Red from Team Rocket's view is very awesome. Yeah, dude, that was such, one of my favorite th things I've, I've done. I'll actually uh, kind of spoil this for you guys. Um, do you guys know um, Pokemon Insurgents? Uh, some people have, have, have wondered uh, whenever that's going to be hitting the, uh, the, the channel. We've already played it and everything. It is being worked on. I've never heard of it. Yeah, it's crazy, Zoe. Uh. Okay, I've... <laughs> that is a confirmed emulator. Um. <clears throat> Sorry, I, I had... There's this weird word that came out of my mouth. That's a weird DS glitch from my... Zimbabwe in DS. Remember how I have that? <laughs> you guys remember my Zimbabwe in DS? Yeah, sometimes sometimes with the uh um the save states that it came with uh and everything. Uh it's it's sometimes it glitches out with uh with it. So I need to probably get like a uh a, a, a the the other DS. It's it's um the one from Latvia. <laughs> The Latvian DS? Yeah, 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 that one. All right, can I run? Can I run? Can I run? Okay, well, <laughs> shit. <laughs> what if I just go in there and just catch one of the Pokemon? Actually. States, you say? Yeah, so it's crazy. Uh, the if you If you're curious... The uh, Zimbabwean uh, DS actually has the option for save states. It was one of the first DSs that were released for some reason. Nintendo had a really uh, strange marketing scheme here. Um, and uh, uh, yeah, uh, they, they found it wildly unpopular. So they uh, stopped with the save states. All right. So we have a Metatite here. So I'm just going to throw a Pokeball at it and hope it works. God damn it. <laughs> Imagine though. Imagine. Slice Acorn, thanks for the tier one. Thank you, Zach. <laughs> damn it. Why don't you just use a DS with an HDMI port on it? I do. That's the Zimbabwean DS. So I have my regular Nintendo DS here, but then I also have my Zimbabwean DS, which has save states and HDMI port and uh, a bunch of other really fun features. Oh my god, okay. So, I'm gonna reload. That. Don't lie to me, I'm not lying to you. I'm being, I'm being completely honest. <laughs> Does it also have 5G? Yeah, it also has internet and everything. All right, I think I'm gonna keep, do you guys, are you guys okay with me reloading until I catch the Pokemon? Or does that, 
I want to, I actually want to check. Is that like fine? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Graveler is also fine. We'll take a Graveler. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Love your video with Purple Cliff. I'm stoked. He he messaged me this morning. He's like, "Hey man, video's doing really well. Thanks for uh, thanks for streaming with me." And I was like, "Oh, thanks, man." <laughs> I was like, "So what if the video didn't do well? Would you say uh, I've never streamed with you again?" <laughs> but uh, like literally, like I feel like most of that video that he put on was literally carried by him because he's so fucking funny. I feel like Purple Cliff is a very underrated streamer, and he's he's already very like very popular too. <laughs> the man is a genius. Okay, well, actually, genius is... is... <laughs> but, Slim Rita, thanks for the proud game. I'm glad most of you guys get the ghost place left now. Okay, so we have to go here. Wait, no, no, this... Oh, okay, okay. Was it this one? No, it wasn't this one. It was the stairs that I have to go down. It was the stairs that I have to go down to get to the gym one. I heard of him before you collab, but he was entertaining. Yeah, I found him on TikTok. <laughs> and then he followed me on Twitter. And I was like, yo, you know who I am? That's crazy. I know who you are. Uh, and then it's this stairs right here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, awesome. <laughs> All right, gym one, guys. But huge shout outs to Ghost Place Left. I, I attribute Ghost Place Left to my victory there. Yeah, I think it's also like helpful choosing the water type first because of literally this exact reason. I'm sure you'll rock this gym. Oh, God. I think you need to be a little bit bolder when you tell your jokes. There's not... There's, I have some negative sediment whenever I hear that. Yeah, I know, I know. Laugh it up. Hardy, har, har. <laughs> yeah, you got, you really got some stones. Telling a joke like that. Uh, all right. Sorry, guys. I, I know, I know I have good content. I realize it. I know I have good content. Sometimes I really take it for granite. <laughs> Yo, it's on, on one HP, dude. Really, Onyx? I'm doing this so I level up, by the way. Because you're curious. All right, so we now have a level 11 pip up. All right, sick. All right. I'm going to save here. <laughs> Um, we're gonna have many save states. All right. First gym. Insane Cat sings the 200 bits. Comedy. First gym down. Or, well, we're doing first gym. I don't know if it's down yet. You know, I'm kind of screaming internally, but that's fine. All right, first try. Let's get it. All right, Pico blesses. Pico blesses that all of our uses of bubbles hit strong and hard. Nice! One shot! Let's go! I forgot how easy this game is. Especially when you know someone like me. Uh, if I recall, he has another. He has an Onyx Necrinidos. Yeah, hard bubbles. I mean, think about it, right? Like, how else, how else are we supposed to, like, kill Roar, right? Like, it. it like, uh, what, you, you blow a bubble, it pops, and then the onyx is like, Oh, God, I've been shot! Like, come on, like, the bubbles must be, like, filled with some sort of, like, uh, arsenic or <laughs> some poison. Go, Piplup, use murder bubble! See, I, that, doesn't, that doesn't have a ring to it. Nice, level 13. 
did someone say arson? Why'd people happy? <laughs> Alright, so Cranny Dose, we just bubble, but Cranny Dose actually could, like, kill us here. Piplup, use kill! Oh, yep, that's that's why. Yep, because Cranny Dose. We can stop. Nah, that's cool, man. That's cool. Nah, I, I really liked that when uh, we died there. That was my favorite part. <laughs> this game is easy, by the way. Jim won done, by the way. My streamer. <laughs> but the real run starts now, though. That's what, that's what I, I really mainly did that so I can gain levels. When you think about it, in that fight, we actually gained two levels. So, now, some of you guys are thinking, Point Crow, oh my god, you didn't, get, you died, you didn't get the first gym. However, I say, fuck you, uh, I'm right, you're wrong, you suck, uh, and, um, uh, I actually gained levels from that, so that was on purpose. Um, what, why don't we come back to Sangam Town? This doesn't really give us much. Let's, uh, let's continue on. There's a couple, uh, other spots up here. At least we know where Gym 1 is, though. Progress! Alright, so Bidoof... Oh my god, this is going to be so difficult. We're going to use Bubble, and it only does half health. Wow, really? <laughs> Wait, that's crazy. NDS emulators are still kind of bad to this day. I know. It's okay. Sorry, Sangum. Sorry, Sand what town? It's Sand... Is not Sand Gem? Is it Sand Gem? Or is it Sand Gem? Okay, the, the okay, Sand Gem is what you're saying. Is this the dick joke? No, no, I'm actually curious. <laughs> like, like I, I don't know how to pronounce things. Uh, very evidently by, uh, uh, whenever one of you guys use your primes, I will mispronounce your name. It happens, right? You're like, oh, hey, you know, I'm going to subscribe with Prime. I can't wait for a streamer to say name. I don't really know. <laughs> um, but you know, you can't wait for that. And then, and then, uh, and then I mispronounce it horribly. That's, that's what happens. Also guys, chat, happy holidays, happy holidays. Can you believe it's already primed to Point Crow Monday? Bender Chan, uh, happy holidays. <laughs> Glad you've been in, uh, been enjoying. I know, it's, it's crazy. Fierce Duty Life, thanks for the, the Prime Gaming. And happy holidays. All right, I'm just, we're just skipping through all this because I know it's Looker and all that fun stuff, but... Gussie's Barricus, thanks for 100 bits. Living the Boy, thanks for extending your subscription through December. PlayStation with the Prime Gaming as well. You finished Black and White? I did. It's on the bot channel. And Platinum Wolf, thanks for the Prime Gaming. All right. All right. So now we're in Jubilife. Oh, you guys ready for... <laughs> you guys ready to just absolutely uh, break open the game again? Yellow Fury Real, thanks for the Prime Gaming. All right. So... Where does this lead? Where where is this? Oh, wait, this is a uh... Hey, we got a flag. Nice. And we don't wait. It gave us a flag in our fashion case. But we don't have a fashion case. Did it give us the fashion case? No, it didn't. Interesting. Oh, this is a bike path. Right. Okay. So I need so I'm going to write down um in Jubilife Is this the brown house? Wait. <laughs> yeah, this is this is bike path. Yeah. I made this last night, so I don't really like. I don't really know if it's correct. So I got the. Oh, it's the entrance house. That's what it is. So bike path. Need bike. <laughs> there we go. Ryuki, thanks for the two gifted. Okay, so the next we have the Pokemon Center. Oh, yo! 
So, okay, guys, congratulations. We've beaten the game. Now we're at the Pokemon League. All right, Pokemon League ahead. Oh, that's so cool. Um. Okay, so we're going to go to the PC leads to Poke, uh, Victory Road Exit. And then I have Victory Road Exit lead to Jubilife. PC. Okay. Or just Jubilee. Okay. Because because whenever I have something like that, I gotta mark both places. Right. Okay. So then we have school. Where does the school lead to? Turn back cave. I don't know what turn. What is turn back cave again? I I forget. Like where where is turn back? Like what is what is that? Oh, that's the Giratina stuff. So turn back cave. That's that's so that's ghost place left. Oh, 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 wait, 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 that's actually Giratina. Wait, 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 it actually is. Wait, oh God, wait, what? Wait, wait, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my God. <laughs> I didn't even realize it. Okay, it's only level 47 though. It's not like the level 70 like we wanted, you know? Well, if you catch him here, what happens in the Distortion World fight? I don't think... If you catch him here, does he appear in the Distortion World as well? Cause this is this is turn back cave. This is if you don't catch him, I think. He appears twice. What if we get two Giratinas? We'll have to find out. Cause you guys, I mean, you guys know that like we've solved like we've solved Pokemon Emerald, right? Like we know exactly like okay, this is once you get Rayquaza, then you can move all the stuff, right? And then, you know all that. We've solved Emerald. We have no fucking idea what happens in Platinum's randomizer. So if we can get double Giratina, that's insane. Okay, um, let me look this up, because I'm curious. Actually, uh, can you, get, can you guys do this for me? What are the odds that I catch Giratina with a Pokeball at full health? One percent. Okay, so we just have to do like if it's one percent, count it with me, guys. Count it with me. If it's one percent, um, we have basically one in a hundred tries. So this is number three. Okay. Can you save in the fight? If I recall, RNG works differently. This is number four. Okay. Yeah, if we save A right before pressing the Pokeball, I, if I recall, the RNG is like, it, it's like set or whatever. Oh, I can't aim at a Pokemon that's on site. Okay. A 1 out of 200 chance? I think it might be worth it though. Imagine if you get a shiny. That'd be hilarious because we're basically kind of shiny hunting here. What's the yell? Thanks for the 17 months. Um. Yeah, can I like can I do the whole save thing? Um, like save right before the ball and then catch it. Is that like is that how it works with RNG in, in Gen 4? I know in Gen 3 it doesn't work like that. No, you can't save right before the ball. Okay, I just wanted to double check. You get great balls. If I recall, great balls and pokeballs really don't make the difference when it comes to like this low odds. I could be wrong. Plus, we we can't get a great ball though, because number one, we don't have any money. <laughs> We're poor. 
And number two, we don't have we don't know where a Pokemart is. We haven't found one yet. It would go oh it, it would double our odds, okay. So Great Ball's the, oh Great Ball's the same Ultra Ball double. Sorry, my bad. Okay, interesting. But if we get Giratina, that'd be insane. Okay. I I think it's worth it like this. I th I think I think getting Giratina is worth it. Just like think about it, right? You can save right before the ball in Gen three. No, I don't believe you can. Um, because both Purple Cliff and I had, uh, issues doing that. Bilbo survives Ominous Wind? I don't believe so. I could be wrong with that, though. If he uses Ominous Wind, I'll let him be going. He does not survive Ominous Wind. Yo, you should just get the Master Ball. Yo! Good idea! What if I just get the Master Ball? That's a great idea. Are you racing somebody? No, not yet. I want to play this through solo first, and then we'll race somebody. Um, just because, you know, I, I, I want to do it. And then whoever I race, I'll give, like, all my info. Oopsies. Sorry. Far one. <laughs> do you, okay, so what are... Didn't everybody, like, when they were younger, have, like, Pokeball tips that you, like, learned from, like, online and everything? Right? Where, where you're, like... We're like, oh, if you if you throw the Pokeball and you press A, A, B, A, B, then it'll catch, like, 100% of the time. And, like, you would do that and do it over and over again. Or some people were like, yeah, you guys were like, mash A and B. Or tap the screen. Yeah. I used to stare at the ball and not blink. <laughs> Damn, that didn't work. For the shot, though. All right, I'm going to mash A this time. Maybe it's maybe I have to mash B. That's what it was. It's mash B. Dang. You need a blow into the mic. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It didn't work. I tried, guys. It's not working. <laughs> nice DS controller. Oh, yeah. So, once again, the uh, my Zimbabwean DS. It's crazy how they, they actually had, like, a, like the Zimbabwe DS. They had a, uh, um, basically, a, a port, a USB-C port that was, it was, like, experimental. And then uh, they made the USB-C port be a universal so you can really attach to anything including like controllers um and it was crazy because they also like predicted that they're gonna make the switch controller uh, so i'm able to actually plug into my uh switch pro control into my zimbabwe and ds i mean yeah i i think the zimbabwe and ds was ahead of its time I could be wrong though, but I think I think it was really like it was it was a shame they didn't release it for everybody. You have to hold down A to keep the ball closed. Oh really? Sorry, I was trying to bait out a clip there. <laughs> it's like uh so so chat, what do I do? I, I like I, I hold down B and like it keeps the ball closed so then Giratina gets in. That's how it works. Sorry, I let go of B at the last moment. That's my bad. <laughs> oh my god.
That dude, that would've been so cool though. Imagine if that worked. All right, all right. But I think, you know, we've tried A and B, but like, I think that if you hold down X, then it keeps the Pokeballs closed. And that's how Giratina stays inside. <laughs> All right, I'll try with Y last time. I'll try, I'll try with Y and then we're gonna stop with that. <laughs> uh, Point Crow, you should, you should try Y. Yeah, so if you hold down Y, it keeps the Pokeball closed. That's how it works. All right, I'm holding it. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I'm just sorry, I'm just clip farming. I'm just clip farming. <laughs> Doodle Dan, thanks for the two dollars. If you say stay while fighting a legendary in generation three, you can keep throwing a Pokeball on that same turn, and there's a chance you'll catch it. I've done it before. But Gen 4 is preset with a number of rolls if you save state. I think it's the same way with Gen 3. Or Gen I think it's the same way with Gen 3, yeah. Gotta turn these Zimbabwe and DS upside down. Alright. These are all these are all good good uh, strategies here. Uh, I really loved the uh, when like the the start of like Pokemon and everything. Uh, when uh, <laughs> I really liked the start of Pokemon and everything, when people were kind of like I wouldn't say hesitant, but it was like different. Like they, like they would always like uh, like the the rumors were unverifiable. So like the Mew in the in the truck, you know, all that fun stuff. You can figure out a way to get to the truck and get a Mew. Um, but not just that, but like there was a rumor that circulated uh, during my stay in the elementary school years uh, where if you had Pokemon Fire Red and you beat the gym leaders, sorry, you beat the Elite Four 47 times in a row, they actually get harder on the 47th um, retry where like all of them are like level 100 and then you can also like catch like a specific legendary afterwards 50 all right we're having a uh, decent luck here I guess yeah it was like Mew 3 I actually I think that was I think it was a legendary I think it was like you can get Mew 3 if you beat the uh, elite 4 uh that many times yeah it was mew 3 that's what it was and like there's all this like fan art of what mew 3 actually looked like and they're like i data mined this from the game it was actually in uh emerald but then they ported it over and it looked really strange or like you'd like see those youtube videos of like oh my god oh my god my game glitched my game glitched and then like a mew 3 appears and like no way and it was like really like it was like a fake reaction to mew 3 being in their game and i was like well that's so cool and like as like an elementary school student i was pretty dumb because you know ch children are pretty stupid uh <laughs> and, and uh, i believed it so i actually beat the elite four i think it was 49 times in my pokemon fire red game i have like 900 hours like my save file says 900 hours deoxys and mosty space center was a big one yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, where like you, you, I forgot what it was though, but didn't that end up being true though? Cause like, um, didn't they make it true with like Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire with like the Delta incident or whatever they call it? Yeah, so they made it true. How did you, how did you acquire Deoxys beforehand? Like, if you didn't do the, the, the NASA, you know, if you didn't do that with the Delta episode, right? It was an event. Okay. Gotcha. So, similar to events with, like, Darkrai and stuff. That makes a lot. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Which, I actually did get the, uh, when I was younger, um, it was really, actually really cool. Because I ended up going to one of those events like the in-person events where it's like if you go to this in-person event they'll give you like a mew i think it was um with fire red leaf green uh i ended up going to my uh, one in my local toys r us uh which was pretty cool um 
but uh, I had a DS. So my sister and I went to the local Toys R Us. We had a DS and we waited in line. And we were like one of the last people in line too. And it was really cool. It was a really fun experience. But then we get into the, like the, 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 uh, it was so weird. Cause like we waited in a hallway and then like they opened the door and there was a man sitting there in a chair being like, come in. And it was like, it's like, like we were, it felt like an interrogation, like uh, in hindsight, you know? Uh, it's like, come in. And then like we, you'd sit down and you'd, you'd take your DS or your, your Game Boy out and he'd attach it and he'd be like, all right, it's been traded. <laughs> and then he would just give you, he would he would give you the, the Pokemon, right? The, the Mew. But my sister and I, um, we had Nintendo DSs. And little did we know because uh, my parents didn't really know much about video games and we didn't either. Like, you know, Game Boy games work on the Nintendo DS. But um, you can't trade between Nintendo DS's. Uh, you just can't do it. Um, and so we got there and he's like, hey man, I'm sorry, but like, I can't give this mute to you and your DS, sorry, you and your sister, because you have a Nintendo DS, you don't have a Game Boy. And then it was the sweetest thing. Because the man behind us was like, oh, hey, 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 I have a, I have a Game Boy. Let me just give you my Game Boy. You can plug it in and then we can trade it real quick and then you'll, you'll hand it back uh, to me and then you'll get your Mew. And then we, and then we did it. And it was the nicest, like that, that guy, I, I, I don't remember what he looks like, but I remember that action because it is one of the nicest things that, uh, that, that has like half, like I keep that with me. Cause it's like oddly like the nicest thing Rather than being like, ah, oh, you don't have a, you don't have a Game Boy, you're fresh out of luck. We're like two little eight-year-olds <laughs> or so being like, I want this Mew. And he's like, hey, I got you. I'll help you out with this. Because the, the guy who was giving the mystery gift or whatever, uh, like the, the, traded, the traded Mew didn't actually have like a second Game Boy uh, for some reason. Harley J, thanks for the uh, six months. Um, and I forgot how we went to that. I think we were like shopping and then like, uh, like we just saw it in the store and we were like, oh, cool. We'll just like take that, you know? But yeah, that, that, that is, uh, um, if, if you guys don't like remember those, that, that was like a thing that happened, uh, that used to happen. Like you, you would go into a store, a physical store to get these like gifts or like events and stuff. If you wanted like... The, it wasn't Sevy Islands, but it was like a special ticket or whatever. Um, uh, if you wanted like a special ticket or whatever, uh, you needed to actually go in to like a brick and mortar store and retrieve it from a guy. Doesn't your uncle work for Nintendo? Yeah, yeah, but he works in the, the Zelda department. Not the Pokemon department yet. Hopefully I got promoted. Um, what number are we on? 83? Do I keep trying, chat? I'll, I'll leave this up to you guys. Do I keep trying for Giratina? Call me King. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Good luck, gamer. I saw you blow into the mic. I won't let you know. If you do that in Gen 5, it'll legitimately change the catch RNG if you make noise. No shot. Are you serious? All right, we'll continue up. All right, we'll continue doing it. Wait, are you, wait, okay, okay. So if you blow into the mic while you're, if you blow into the mic while you're trying to catch your Pokemon in Gen 5, it actually works. Is that legitimate or is that fake? Like don't, don't Josh me. Cause I, I, I feel like it's easily believable. Yes, dude. Blow into the mic, Gen 5 catch rate. Wait, wait, blow, blowing into the microphone. It's from, oh, I can't click on it for some reason. <laughs> guys, are so, guys are so fucking mean. <laughs> 
Stop it. All right, it's, uh, yeah, source, trust me, bro. No, oh, fuck off. Oh, my. You, literally the worst Twitch chat. No, 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 no. No, you don't get to stream anymore. You don't get to stream. No, you don't, you, you don't get to watch my game. No, you, you don't get to watch my game. This is this is stream now. No, fuck you. No, this is what you've done. This, like, you got to live with your actions. Oh, oh, my God. <gasps> chat, we caught it. Some of you believed me, though. <laughs> Some of you definitely believed me. No, we didn't. No, no, you totally did. Also, you're stupid. <laughs> Got him. Oh, shit. Anyways. I've been thinking of playing some other games recently, you know? Um... I'm playing some other games recently, but I've been playing that one game where it's like you're with like a uh, um, oh I can't remember it. I've been playing like New World and stuff, um, and recently like Risk of Rain and all. But what's that one game with like pirates? Uh, um, it's like it's the the multiplayer pirate game. See if these see if these balls fit in your mouth. Got them. Jesus Christ. Anyways, hey guys, I've been seeing... <laughs> I've been seeing... I've been watching movies recently. What's that one? Uh, um, what's that one movie with Zendaya in it? Rec I, I forgot what it was. It's, yeah, Dune? Yeah, 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 it's pretty cool. What's, what's the, uh, um, you know, it's Dune. Yeah, you're right. That's, that's what I want to ask. What's, what's the, it's, what's the, the house? It's like house. <laughs> house Atreides balls. <laughs> Atreides nuts. <laughs> Trady's dick. <laughs> I could I could have said it earlier because you guys already know it, right? Where it's like, oh, what's that? It's Dune. <laughs> I'm doing your mom. But uh, you know, I, I felt to take I wanted to take it a little bit one step further. Uh, I want to take it just one step further. Yo, Eric, I'm moving. I'm glad you're moving. Hopefully away from the stream. <laughs> I'm sorry. That was mean. Good luck with your move, though. Dude, I would like to catch this one Giratina. That would be awesome. If we can catch this Giratina, that would be awesome. That would be great. We're on uh, attempt number 101. Where does sugar come from? glucose or that is sugar i don't i don't understand where i'm supposed to where I, that's a dick joke for sure but like i don't understand the yeah it's sugar cane glucose the size of my nuts <laughs> what <laughs> Wait, what what is this <laughs> Oh, it's like sugar cane these balls fit your mouth. Oh, okay, that's a stretch. That that's like that's that's a very that's a big stretch, guys. That is like a very big stretch. Spell among us backwards. Sugon the uh, Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay. Alright, alright, all right. Yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> That's actually really good. No, I haven't seen that before. Or if I have, I don't remember it. Yeah, yeah. It said kid, kid among us backwards is sug on a dick.
Um, chat. I don't know if we're catching Giratina. This is this is this is this is uh going on for a little, little while. You know what? Let's go until 169 attempts. How about that? 169 attempts, and then we're good. That sound good? All right, watch this. If I I'm going to close my eyes for this next one. I'm going to close my eyes and watch. It's going to catch. <laughs> but like, imagine though. Yeah, it's like me trying to get seven 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 in, in the uh, the <laughs> in the casino. I was like, yeah, let me just close my eyes and, and see if we get it. Try try crow. Just try asking nicely. Hey, Mister Giratina, can you be caught? Can you please stay in the Pokeball this time? That would be awful. That would be great. Is it shiny locked? I don't think so. But it's also like 1 in 8,196 odds to be shiny. So like, I, I would not be surprised if we didn't find a shiny this playthrough. Although it's really funny because we did find a shiny in my uh, um, Pokemon Black playthrough, which was great. Because in, in, in the Pokemon Black playthrough, um, uh, I killed it. No, no, I ran away from it. I ran away from the shiny because like we weren't allowed to catch Pokemon in the challenge. So I was like, okay, I gotta, I gotta stay by my rules. <laughs> Sucks. I wonder. If, I wonder. If, does anyone have the clip of it? I'm curious. Yeah, what, I'll find a shiny before I catch it with a Pokeball. The odds of you catching Giratina with a Pokeball are better than the odds of my ex taking me back. <laughs> you don't... <laughs> I don't want to say that. I just wanted to highlight that message. God damn. Julian, thanks for the 500 uh, bits. Thank you. Have you gotten a single shake once? Yeah, I've gotten shake. Uh, I, I got it where it shaked three times. I think I yeah, we got three shakes one of those times, right? So I'm gonna go Pokeball, right? Yeah, so right there it, sh it, it shaked twice. I'm just speeding it up so you don't see it. Is this chat okay? Chat, are you guys okay? See, that's one shake. Two shakes. Yeah. I'm just speeding it up so you don't see the shakes. It's, uh, what, a 0.4% catch rate? Why are we saying no? I was asking if you guys were okay. Joe! Found out I have scar tissue in my ribs from when we went skydiving. How? Joe, how? <laughs> what? Are you? Joe, are you okay? Joe, Joe, are you? <laughs> are you fine? <laughs> I'm fine now? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, if you need emotional support, like, let me, let me know if you need anything. Oh my god. How do, how do you have scar tissue in, from your ribs from skydiving? Was it because you got, like, like you got jerked when you, uh, got it down? I need people to sub to my good friend Point Crow to feel better. Oh, because they jerked me real good. Okay, yeah, that's that. Okay, thanks, Joe. <laughs> but, but, uh, yeah, you know, if you want to make Joe feel better, drop a primer. One prime equals one step closer to Joe feeling better. <laughs> that's 
It's it's real. That, that's real. One prime equals one new rib for Joe Sniffy. <laughs> Hopefully he feels better from being jerked around. <laughs> After being jerked real hard. No, I no, I see it. No primes. No, I, I get it. There's no primes. You guys hate Joe. That's cool. I understand it. No, I also hate Joe. It's fine. Relatable, right? <laughs> My lungs. Fix them. Please, fix them. Tracy, thanks for taking one for the team and priming for 15 months. <laughs> Tracy, thank you for healing Joe. Who needs snake oil when we have prime gaming? Same thing, right? I have 12 ribs, though, I think. Wait, how many ribs does a person have? I actually don't know that. I feel like that's, I feel like that's vital information. Definitely four, at least. Okay. How many Pokeballs? People are counting in chat. We're going up to 169. If we can't catch it, then we'll continue on. Molten, thanks for the four months. Thank you. Welcome back to the murder. Let's go! We caught it! Oh, we caught it! It was banished for violence. We, we don't even have the first gym badge. <laughs> All right, what do we name it? What do we name our Giratina? Gagging? No, it's pagging. <laughs> you say pagging, not gagging. <laughs> I, I, I always like it a... Uh, um, I always like it to be a um, pun on the name. Oh, Grill Tina is pretty good. Where's the T? <laughs> I can't spell. All right, so Grill, grill Tina. That's pretty good. Do we, can we go into this distortion world now? Like, is this like another thing? It's a portal into the distortion world. Would you like to leap into the portal? Okay, so distortion world leads to distortion world. Okay, good to know. Okay. Um, so turn back cave also has right, left, up and down. Okay, we're still on... Guys, we have like an hour and 20 minutes in. And we're still in Jubilife. <laughs> um, I'm going to put... I, we're going to explore everything else. But I'm going to put in Jubilife in the school, turn back cave. And I'm going to note that it's unexplored. Right? I'm going to note that this is unexplored. Right, so so if we go back to like, Dad, I saved. Dad, I, I already saved. Um, so if I go, to, you'll see here, I'm I'm like labeling yellow. As like we haven't gotten it. Okay. But uh, because because you guys are asking, just in case, I got you. There. Okay. Yo! Oh my God! Past here's the global terminal. Oh, you can only access it if you own, if you have gym badges. Oh, interesting. Okay. So Pokemon Center. Oh, Pokemon Center is Victory Road exit. That's what it was. All right, that makes sense. Okay, so then the Pokemon Mart is. Oh, <gasps> yes, our first Pokemon Center. Yes. Okay, so this is the Jubilife Pokemon Center too. Oh, that's huge. That's actually huge. Pokemon Center, I'm gagging. Wait, pagging. <laughs> I I hate how I read that. I hate, I hate how I read out that dodo. I hate it. I, I regret, I regret. All right, um, so we have the exit here. Uh, which leads to some Jubilife thing here. 
Okay. Oh! Is this the mall? Wait, where is this? Oh! Oh, oh, this is the... Wait, no, this isn't the mall. This is not the mall. This is the Jubilife Center. Jubilife TV. Oh. Okay. So that's interesting. Because I actually don't have a spot for Jubilife TV. Right? I'll mark that for later. Um, we were on the fourth floor. Yeah, Jim one's in- Oh, yeah, Jim one is in here. Right, right. Uh, Jim one's in here. It's on the third floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Would your team listen with no gym badges? Yeah, because we didn't trade it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> so if we... <laughs> Just kindly switch it out. <laughs> all right, first gym badge. <laughs> All right, this one's gonna be a toughie. This one's gonna be insane. Jackson, thanks for the two months. All right. Uh, I think we have to use something like probably Dragon Claw. Just narrowly one hit KO'd it. Narrowly one hit. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I was a bit under leveled coming into this, but we did manage to win it in the future. In the, in the, we did it. We did it. What a close fight. First gym badge done, though. Nice. A lot has happened in an hour? Yes, but we haven't explored a lot of this yet. Which is kind of crazy. Like, we haven't really explored a lot of, uh,. A lot of this. Um, I'm going to continue and note that Jubilife isn't finished. We're going to continue on with like looking at Jubilife though, you know? Because Jubilife oddly leads to Jubilife. Let's go back over here. Let's see what this is. Ooh, another Mount Cornet. So I'm also going to note that this is not explored yet. I feel like a lot of it, like I don't know... Like, I don't know where things lead, so I want to explore it. This is the brown building. Brown building goes to Pastoria. Pastor is it Pastoria? Pastoria? All right, things are opening up again. And if I go to Pastoria... It's, oh, so it's Pastoria, okay. And then Pastoria is over here. And the brown house, this is the vent house. It's the Jubilee. Pastoria. Yeah. Bugs is in. Thanks for the two months. All right. So I'll go back. Um, oh, we have to talk to the clowns, don't we? Oh, wait. We can't go into... We can't unlock this war. Um... Povich can't say you should brush up the trainer school. So we actually have to go to the trainer school before we get to Jubilife access. That's interesting to know. All right, next question I have is like, is is the uh, whatever poke club? Is this like are two are each of them random? Okay, well we got another PC, and then this one. Oh, they are different. They are they are different. Okay, they are different. Um, so Poker Club 1 leads to a PC. You didn't know. Yeah, it's the, it, it's the Poke Edge. That's what it is. Wait, this is actually so... Oh! Wait, is it is it every Pokemon Center that has an up and down escalator? I forget. Is it every one? Okay. Okay. So this is interesting. This technically counts as the 
It says that this is also the Jubilife. It says this is also the Jubilife um, PC. Because we were last seen in Jubilife. So it looks like either they both link to Jubilife or we can't use the teleport strategy we used to use in Gen 4. Yeah. For Thunder, thanks for the 100 bits. All right, so this is to go back. Doesn't look the same NPC. Yeah, it's not the same NPCs. Yeah. It's not. So we can't use the uh, teleport strat here. Yeah, because that should this should lead to the uh, Pokemon, but it does not. Okay, so Poke Club one leads to a PC. Poke Club two. Uh, yeah, Poke Club two leads to Galactic. That was Galactic HQ, right? Love these random maps are insane. It's so cool. I mean, the teleport strategy probably works, but we don't know where we're going. Oh, and then it leads to PC to Solsi on ruins. Dude, this is this is opening up a ton, right? And we can actually like go through this, right? Like, cause like the Pokemon were in. Ca oh, okay. So the ruins have a very low encounter rate. That's good to know. Okay. No, this is, dude, dude, this is, like, there's so many more warps in Platinum than Emerald. Wait, which gym is this? Wait, this is gym four, isn't it? Wait, what the fuck? Wait, what? Gym five, gym, gym four, gym four. So you guys say it's, it's five in Platinum. Okay, it's gym five in Platinum. Water place left. Okay. So we can't beat gym five yet until we beat gym two. <laughs> Wait, is this where I think it is? Is this like the post dude? I didn't write down the post game. I don't know I don't know anything about the post game. Right? Like, if you look here, I didn't write anything about post-game. Oh my god! Wait, there's post-game. Alright, I gotta write that down for later. Uh... Um, how do I write down Sol- Because I also have to do, like... Solacyon Ruins. Right? Leads to post-game. Right, I'm just gonna put that there. Okay, so where does this lead? The fucking Celestic Town! Oh my god! <laughs> okay, alright. Um So Celestic Town. This was the uh Upper right, upper left. This is the cabin. Not Cornet. Draco Meteor House. Wait. Wait, what is this house? This is a house on the upper left and upper right. Am I right? Then there's the cabin, there's the cave, there's the PC, and there's Mount Coronet. Oh, I didn't write down, <laughs> I didn't write down this house. Apparently this house doesn't exist in my mind. Um just so I'll just write down house. And house leads to the the Solcyon Ruins. I feel like me. Mapping this out is actually very helpful in the long run. I could be wrong with that, but I think it's actually like a good idea. I could be I could be wrong once again. But I think I think actually writing it down is like actually very helpful. Alright, so the gate leads to What is that? Like what is this thing? Like this this uh TM or or Whatever. What is that?
that's dark pulse all right yeah it's not earthquake because earthquakes like in a weird other spot i remember that all right so that's nothing so i'll write down gate equals nothing this dark pulse really won't help us um okay so then there's orberg cave this way we also need to check out how does the underground work i don't know i don't think the underground is in existence also looker looker you're on a fence looker literally a fence sitter <laughs> and he disappeared okay Looker, looker, not looking so hot right now. <laughs> looker, are you gonna do end game in Shining Pearl, Brilliant Diamond? Uh, once you see what we're gonna be doing with Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl, I think you'll realize. I don't want to spoil anything, but you'll you'll figure you'll see it and you'll be like, what? Oh my god. Okay, okay, the thing I've been teasing, we've confirmed it works. I've been I've been teasing it to you guys for Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. I've been teasing it to you guys, not knowing if it actually works. It works. It works. We're doing it. Sorry, it, it's like it's confirmed. I, I can't tell you though. I can't tell you because the moment I tell you is the moment anybody can do it. And I'm so sure that nobody has this. You gotta wait till you gotta wait till Friday. You gotta wait till Friday. I do want to tell you guys really badly, so, but I won't do it because because I want you guys to be surprised. Uh, all right. So Orberg, uh Cave. Where does this lead? The original owners. <laughs> wait, this is our house. Wait, this is like our post game house. I didn't buy any. So yeah, I know it's barren. It's still not bad. Anyways, I feel kind of bad imposing on your place for nothing. Tell you what, order a table from this order form. I'll do as my thanks. Yeah, yeah. Okay, sure. Th thanks for the table, man. Thanks for waiting. I'm delivering your order. I well, hope you give your ordering quality furnishings for us. Sick. We have our house now. Okay. I'm finding really yeah, the villa. I I <laughs> we got a free house. Woo, that's a wicked awesome. You must be rich. Give me something. I mean, I'm not rich, I just have primes. So we got a free house. Nice. It's so funny. You walk through a cave, you get a free house. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> All right. So cave is also nothing. Who knew? You know, chat, if you find your local cave, walk through, you have a chance of getting a free house. All right. So next we got to check out is Ravage Path. We get, if I recall, there's a, there's a, an Abra. I, I could be wrong with this, but I think there's an Abra that can appear here. And I think we want to catch this Abra. I think catching this, like catching an Abra here is, from what my experience of map randomizers, this is what exactly we want to do. Yeah, there is Abra here. Okay. Is it just in Platinum that there's Abra here? I could be, I could be wrong with it. There is, okay. Oh, all Gen 4 games. I don't know, are you guys excited for Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl? I know some people were uh, a little apprehensive of it because of the uh, like new graphics and all. But I'm excited. But like, I want to know if you guys are. I'm stoked. It looks really cute. <laughs> it looks really cute. A lot of people have been wanting Gen 4 remakes for a while. Undergrave, the underground cave bits look sick. I actually haven't seen it. Um, I don't know if I can do underground though. But, uh, yeah, it looks good. I'll, I'll have to take a look at it, though. Chaos CSGO. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. All right, so we have the Abra. No Pokeball? Please catch. First try. First try. Let's go! All right, that was sick. All right, Abra was uh, all that stuff. And that was uh, teleport. Does he use mash A? I held A to close the Pokeball. That's how it worked. Copious sad thanks for the two months. 
It should be seven, but it glitched for some reason. <laughs> okay. I'm actually a tier three sub to uh, Abby Bagel, but uh, it's glitched and it only says tier one. Okay, if you name it Abra, like, uh, come on. That's like low hanging fruit. RB. No. <laughs> no free lunch. Um, What do I name it? Abby? Fine. We'll name it Abby. Abby the Abra. All right. Um, so if we go, so we found that we need to find out what Ravage Path is looking like right now. We could also just wait. If I use teleport, is it going to tell us? Wait, wait, no, 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 no! I actually didn't want to go. I thought it had like a confirmation message. Okay, good to know. Teleport's kind of a just just random dice throw. Good good to know. <laughs> Shit. Alright, well we're out of the loop now. Uh that we were current that we were in before. Uh okay, Spur, thanks for the three months. Zebra, thanks for the five months. Welcome back. Um, alright, so Orberg. Uh let's check it out. Alright, so PC. What is the PC in Orberg? Oh, this is story. I forgot about this. Welcome to the First Order, where we've it's the gathering of yeah. What's the? No. It's the Cyrus speech. I appear today as Cyrus. Oh, all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna speed this up for obviously. Yeah, I just got the warp, warp, like, warp trip does work, but how do you get the town map again? Right. All that fun stuff, blah, blah. That's just story unlock. Oh, we had story unlock, and then we also have a warp there. I'm glad we checked it. What is this? The rugged rock by Pokemon might be able to smash it. Wait, what is this again? Oh, that's turn back cave again. But where in turn back cave? Oh, it's just a room in turn back. Oh, wait. Okay. There's a lot of turn back cave rooms. Okay, good to know. You get the town map at the trainer school. Oh, okay. Okay, so Orberg PC leads to turn back, which we need to discover later. Um, okay. So the next, let's check out, let's go over here. Let's check out the apartment. Yeah, so apartment complex one. Oh my god! Wait, does, is this a random... Is this... Can we go inside there? Like, can we go inside here? Alright, let's dress up Giratina. Okay, that doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> hey, wait, wait, I don't want to do this anymore. Wait, I don't want to do this. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I don't think I have any accessories either. No, okay. Is your Pokemon all dressed up? Yeah, he's so sexy. Alright. <laughs> Sorry. So apartment one is nothing. Good to know. I actually don't have uh let me do this. I don't have the um Orberg Cave. Yeah, from Orberg. Bob, thanks for the three months. Oh, thud! Whoops, Grilly, you got the gym badge, huh? Where are you? Where is he? He's gone! 
going back to Jubal life. All right. 10 seconds before he dies. Bye. He's got the time to count. He's invisible. Ooh. He's so speedy, you can't even see him. Nice. All right. All right, good to know. I oh, got the water stone, though. Free water stone. Uh, all right. Hello, man. Can I? Can I get into this apartment? There we go. Thanks. Oh, wait. This is Iron Island. All right. So if I recall, you need to beat Iron Island with Riley to get strength, or do you just meet Riley at the end? I forget what it is. He gives you strength at the start. When you beat him. Okay. Alright, so I'll mark Iron Island for later. I want to check out everything first. Because I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Where I'm not supposed to go, you know. Um, Pokemart next. Dude, I really got to... I gotta figure. I get Solcyon Ruins has so many warps. We're inside of a woman yet again. <laughs> okay. Uh, so it goes Eterna. First time. Uh, Eterna, and then it goes to, uh, Oraberg. Uh, this is scuffed how I'm doing this. All right, and then the Mart leads to Solcyon 2. I'll call it that. What now? What? What? Oh my god! Who are we? Uh, gym number four. Okay. Um, let me put into Eterna that the gym leads to Solacion Ruins 2. That's pretty cool. All right, so we need gym two, three... Six, seven, eight, and the rest of the Elite Four. All right, that leads to the fight area. Dude, this is the survival area, the fight area. I forgot about all of these. It's post game again. Oh my God. Uh, So now we're inside of a, oh, okay. Yeah, now we're inside of a man. <laughs> Interesting. All right. Um, and then next we'll check left of gym house. Wait, this is Solcyon three. <laughs> There's another dude. How many Solcyon ruins are there? A lot? How many are a lot? Right? So it leads to... Oraberg. Okay. <laughs> How are we finding all of the gyms? What? What? Okay, Gym 7. Dude, yo! What is the scene, man? All of the gyms are in the ruins. That's so funny. Oh, hello. Who are you? Not Cornet Towers, Sinnoh, Close Space, blah, blah. blah. Alright, so. That's a. Uh, that's useless. Okay. You found the Pokemon League Secret Gym Teleporter? Ah, yes! <laughs> Little did they know. And then turn back, Kate. Which I also don't want yet. So then turn back it. <laughs> I... 
chat. I don't know why I did this. Uh, so look down here. I wrote Solcyon 3, Orberg, Gym 7, turn back, CAC. <laughs> I meant to write cave. <laughs> I don't know what's happening in this stream anymore. <laughs> Uh, all right, <laughs> next we got the gym. Okay, so gym here. Are you a trainer? I don't have Pokemon. I'm the gruntiest of the grunts. Okay, this is a this is a, a one warp, which leads to a cutie lakefront. Actually, that's pretty big. So Cutie Lake um, is in technically um, Snow Point, which leads to Orberg. Yeah, look, it's Cutie Cinderella's Lake. You need rock climb for that? Gotcha. Okay, so then we have the left gym house. Wait, what was, what was left gym house? That's, that was Solcyon 3, right? Yeah, okay. Um, okay, so that was Solcyon 3. The cutie at the lake is you, Point Crow. All right. <laughs> they all have like the eight months. All right, so we gotta check out the uh, museum here. Wait, are you the underground guy? No, you're you're the trendy. Wait, wait. This isn't the underground guy. This is the shards guy. Right, right. He doesn't know how to respond to compliments. I don't know. What do I say to that? What do, what do, what do, okay, what would you say, chat? What would you say to that? Uh, the only cutie is you. What do, what do you say? What what? Do, how am I supposed to respond? What people shy? Thank you. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. All right. Uh, this is the mine house, and then you, you're the guitar guy. Oh, this is at the resort, isn't it? Right. Game 92, Trick Room. Okay. Trick Room's actually interesting. Um, all right. So we did that. So mine house is nothing. Wait, museum was also nothing, right? I totally forgot. I just, I'm, I'm literally like, I am, I am on autopilot yeah museum was also nothing let me thanks for the prime gaming jello gumdrops thanks for the two months appreciate that guys i'm glad you guys are enjoying but the museum is nothing right the mine we haven't checked out yet the right of the gym house is this one over here explorer's kit though he didn't have explorer's kit what was this swagger I have that, right, chat? Welcome to my opulent mansion. Oh, this is the mansion. Right, 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 this is the mansion. Very expensive looking book on Pokemon. Would you like to read it? Sure, Manaphy. Right, so we see Manaphy now, okay. Right, that's that's in case like you, you, you don't have like, what was it? The Ranger kind of thing where you like board in Manaphy from, from Pokemon Rangers or something. So you can have it like for your Pokedex entry. Okay. I could be wrong though. You catch Giratina? We did. We did catch Giratina, which was hilarious. All right, so now we have the mine as another warp. Dude, this is like this is like the uh, um, Aqua Hideout all over again, right? So this is Galactic HQ, and then I gotta mark it as um, we don't we haven't explored it yet. We caught yeah right. We caught one of the Giratinas. <laughs> There's, I think two. <laughs> Technically, if you if you do it right, I think you get two. Um, all right, and then we can't actually go up here because we don't have the bike. So there's a couple things we can do here. We can go to Iron Island, Turnback Cave, or Galactic HQ. Which one should we do? Up to you guys. Tikatik, thanks for the four months. 
Galactic HQ, Turnback Cave, or Iron Island? All right, Galactic HQ. All right, sounds good. How many gyms? We've gotten one gym so far. Well, we found a couple of this. Okay, so this is Galactic HQ, um, which has so many warps. How do you keep track of all of the warps here? What is this? Uh, fogs, here's everything. Oh, okay. I guess we don't. Okay, right, that's that's useless. That's that's the top of the uh, uh, Solcyon Tower. No, no, it's the not the Solcyon. It's um, Canalate. Oh, yo! Nice. <laughs> I rare candy. Okay, that's cool. I'm glad that these are useless, though, because I don't want to write them down. That's the ghost place, right? Okay, so we're all good there. Okay, so we just have to, like, beat you guys, who were definitely, like... Level 38? I mean, we're almost 10 levels above them, but, like... That is not, <laughs> that is not exactly as overpowered as I thought it was. It's not Rayquaza. That's not gonna kill. It's actually gonna one shot exactly as I predicted it would because literally it's, we have Griltina, you know? Where you get the Arceus encounter? Can you? Is that a thing? Like, can you get the Arceus encounter in this? Because I think, that, like, don't you have to, you have to get, like, a, like, it's not, like, a different warp, is it? It's, like, it's Spear Pillar, but you have to do something in Spear Pillar with the Azure Flute. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I don't think you can. You can definitely get Darkrai, though. Yeah, because Darkrai's a thing. And you also get Cresselia. And Shaman? You... No, I don't think you can get Shaman without Oak's Parcel. Or Oak's Letter. Oh my god, he literally did like half my half my health. Jesus. At least my Piplup's getting levels though. And we're faster too. Hey, it's Prinplup! All of Origins included in the warps, so you don't need the Shoot Flute. Oh, so we can get Arceus! I put Arceus in the pool. Okay, thanks. Appreciate that. Yeah, uh, yeah. You don't. You don't have to. Just, just at me, uh, um, Luma and, and Isaac. I'll see it. You don't have to use your highlight message or anything. <laughs> I'll see it. Thank you. Wait, like you're, you're. I don't want you uh, wasting your channel points or anything. All right. So you can get Arceus. That's sick. If we want to get Arceus, we can get Arceus. I don't remember this part. Like this place in the old chateau. Wait, this place in the old chateau doesn't have any warps, if I recall. Ooh, rare candy, nice. Yeah, I remember this room. I think it's like if you stay here long enough, right? Was it where you stay here long enough, like the the chandelier moves or something? What wasn't wasn't that what it was? I could be wrong. There's like there was something where it's like you there was like a ghost appears. Is it? Wait, which, which, wait, wait, where is it? Where is it? I know something happens in here. Oh, it can randomly appear when entering the room. That's what it was. Okay, so when you enter the room, it like, pause, it like, it, you see it and then you, and you, yeah. Okay, not there. <laughs> ah! No, no, no! <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. No, that wasn't worth it. Nah, I, dude, I get freaked out too easily. Dude, I, I do not like scary things. Dude, dude, I do, I, I'm serious. I know it's like the, I, I know it's like the softest thing in the entire world. Where it's like, oh, you're a sprite. I kid you not. That gave me full on shivers. I, I hate scary things. I can't do scary things. 
I, I can't. Um, okay. So, the Galactic HQ, we have now successfully seen all of it. Okay, so now you guys get to choose. Do we go to Iron Island or Turnback Cave? Turn back cave. Oh, a lot of you guys are Iron Island. Okay. So Iron Island is an apartment number two. Okay. Um, and I need to remember where the uh one of the reasons why I want to do this solo first before I do like a, a, a race versus somebody, is because I want to make sure I remember where all of this stuff leads. I haven't played platinum in ages. Do we actually choose? You've already made your choice. Ah. Uh, I see you watch the stream constantly. Escape rope is cool. Where does it lead? I don't know. We can try it. Where, where would... I mean, let me, let me like, let me look at these warps first. Also, we haven't saved in a while either. Uh, let me look at these warps first. Look, we can see if the escape room works. How do you randomize maps? It's a mod that was uh, made by Turtle Isaac, X Luma, and At Sign uh, working together. Um, and uh, pretty cool. Uh, this will be available when my YouTube video is out. So currently is exclusive and only available to me right now. But in the next couple weeks, we'll be uh, putting out a YouTube video. Also, it is not completed. Just because we're playing it on stream does does not mean it is flawless. We've already witnessed, I think, like one one to two actual like full on hard locks. Uh, so we're getting there, right? So we're kind of testing it out. Oh, whoa! Uh, this is a one warp. Oh, the Mount Coronet. Okay, okay, okay. Interesting. Um. So Iron Island leads to Mount Coronet. And then over here. Wait, this is the mansion, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. This is huge. <gasps> Look how many warps we've just unlocked. <laughs> oh, that's that's actually large. Um, okay, so this is, you give me Quick Claw? Yeah. Uh, I will take Quick Claw. And I will give it to our Grill Tina. I wish we named our, our, our starter. I, I, I forgot that we didn't. Okay. Race? We'll do a race later. Once, once we finish this solo. I feel like every time we release a new generation on the universal like, map randomizer and everything, like once we do that, then I go back and uh, we do a solo run and then we do a race with it. All right, so this is the mansion. This is room one. Okay, so room one Leads to Jubilife TV. Um, stay so one floor stairs. One floor entrance. So the stairs lead to basically Orberg. Or no, no, leads leads. They don't lead to Orberg. They lead to. Room one mansion. Okay. Should have named uh you should have chosen Turtwig and named Turtle Isaac. That's actually a good idea. I should have done that. And back to Turnback Cave. So if you go to Turnback Cave. Okay. Turn back cave. Okay. The mansion's now in the loop again. Right, so we have this, right? Oh! I should do the lottery, yeah, right. All right, guys. If I if I get the grand prize, if I win the lottery here,
I'll gift you 100 subs. I'll gift 100 subs if I win the lottery. I'll give 20 if we're second place. Would you like to check today's lucky number? I would. First, I'll look up today's Pokemon corner lucky number. Your lot number is 24019. Do you match the idea of any of your Pokemon? Yeah. We didn't even get we didn't get a fourth. <laughs> Did you check your DMs? Yeah. Oh, uh, let me say bye to Julia and Nance really quick, guys. All right, so um, let me pause chat real quick. One second, chat. I need to say goodbye to my friends. They're leaving the house. Answer is yes. Say yes. Say, say you missed me. <laughs> so I had to say goodbye to them uh, because they uh, uh, came all the way out here um, and uh, they wanted to. Uh, 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 we we, hang, we hung out with them. Uh, we went to the uh, Miyazaki exhibit uh, at LACMA. It's really cool for uh, Studio Ghibli, Ghibli, all that fun stuff. What is this? Uh, it's a one way. So Mount Coronet blocked by um, surf. Okay, so this is, so room one leads to uh, Jubilife TV. So room two leads to Mount Coronet, right? So I'll, I'll share this here. Mount Coronet blocked by surf. <laughs> right, so I, I I think this is a good way of like like counting it and everything, right? All right, so then room three. <laughs> okay, room three is the exit of the mansion. <laughs> That's funny. That's really funny. All right, so room three is uh the mansion itself, and then the mansion is where did I write where did I write this down? The mansion is in Pastoria, so it's um, Mansion Room 3. Yeah, literal misdirection. That's hilarious. Uh, and then we can go up here. So this is the center room. Another turn back cave? Jesus. Past three pillars offer up to the before 30 is surpassed. Okay. So just uh, turn back cave again. Dude, so Turnback Cave is huge then, I'm assuming. It's like a full maze. 
Turn back, cack. <laughs> That's the entrance room. Okay. So this is number four. Uh, where are you again? He's on the notice outside. Hiring the Pokedex. Um, Geo dude, bring me one. Okay. And then Center Reason newspaper. Okay. So nothing. Um. Can we get past that? Can I get past like this? Turnback Cave is 30 randomized floors. 120 warps. Wait, are you are you serious? Wait. Wait, are you serious right now? Any <laughs> warps on the ends of the hallways? Okay, thank you. Okay. Then down here. Oh. Oh, that, that was the entrance to the mansion. Yeah, so this goes back to Iron Island, which goes to Orberg. Okay, so we've mapped out the entirety of the mansion. Turnback has hard-coded warp nonsense, though. Wait, what do you mean? Top of the won't function as really randomized. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 cause, yeah that makes sense. Um, that's insane. <laughs> okay, um, so we have, this is Iron Island. We've discovered all of the warps here and all that. Um, let's go back. Oh, do you guys want an escape rope? Is that what we wanted to try the escape rope and see what happens? Is that what, is that what it was? All right, let's try the escape rope. It should, I, theoretically, it should take me just right outside to... Okay, so it takes you outside. <laughs> it takes you outside of the yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it's the last time you went to the overworld, the last outdoor area you were at. Oh, interesting. That is very weird, though. Yeah, it's where I was like last outside. That's crazy. Okay, that's that's weird and interesting. Oh, also, yeah, let me just do this uh, for simplicity. Good idea. I'm not thinking properly. We're going to TP and we're going to go back to Orberg like that, right? Okay, so. It, let's go to Eterna City. We'll explore it in order next. Um, I feel like we're going to get lost. In t I've. Here's what I feel like. I feel like the moment we start Turn Back Cave, we're gonna get so lost. So we'll, we'll put off Turn Back Cave for like a while, right? <laughs> Is does that, that, that sound good to you guys? I think we'll put off Turn Back Cave. Uh, so we do this and then this goes to a, oh. Um, we're still outside of the loop, by the way. So we can't get back to mom or anything. I guess you guys were curious about it. What if Turnback Cave actually like, casually functions? Which is a hub of three other warps. Um, no, it's a hub of three other warps, I think it is. No, it's not this one. This one. It, that's Gym 7. This one. Never mind, that's Turnback Cave. Wait, I did the wrong one then. Oh, Eterna Solcyon 2. So it's the Pokemon. So it's over over this way. Yeah, so it's, it's this one right here. This is the one I need to go to. Right? And then I go to here, which is Eterna. Yeah, there we go. Hey. <laughs> I'm Gradia. Nice. Um, Actually, his name was Boy. He told me about you. There's another challenge on the way that made me antsy. No one gets to battle gym leader with me until everything else. Yeah, don't disappoint me. Okay, so now, so we just talked to her and now we can go back. There are indeed like 30 maps and turn back. Oh, that hurts. That hurts. But I feel like if you go to turn back cave, it leads to everything else. They have like this nice backbone. All right, so Eterna, we're going to go to the corner house here first. 
Wait, is this the contest hall? Oh, my hero! Hey, look, there's mom! Hi, mom! <laughs> right, I forgot, I forgot mom in this game is actually like, like a contest star. I forgot about that. I, I literally forgot about that. So much pink. So fun. Fantina's also right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. Yes, beg your pardon? Oh, so we actually... Wait, so we... Don't we have to talk to Fantina before we do the fourth gym? Or the, the third gym? Hard homes, third, fourth. Because she won't be there. Or no, it's sixth gym. It's sixth gym, right? So contest hall is actually required. Okay, I'll write that down then. It's it's third gym in platinum. It's third gym. Okay. So the corner house is contest hall, and contest hall is important because we need to do that. Because we can't do third gym without contest hall. Oh, hello. Right this way, please. Oh, this is this is the fun. Yeah. Yeah, this is Wi-Fi Club, Pal Pad, all that fun stuff. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I forgot that we... We're going to encounter some of these. Right, because this is the basement. I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah, we get We get to encounter some basements. Also, these warps, if I recall, don't do anything, so... Can't imagine doing this without writing things down. Yeah, I'm memorizing all of this. Isn't that crazy? My brain's just that massive. Death Claws, thanks for the nine months. Um, right, okay, so contest hall there, and then uh, let's do Mart. Okay, so Mart goes to Solsi on town. Um, let's see, Mart, Solsi on. And this is the, oh, oh, sh uh, sorry, sorry, uh, I'm just trying to, Think real hard. Real, real hard. Oh, she's in the gym regardless. All right, so we don't need contest all, you know. Um, yeah, I'm just, let me think about this real quick on how to do this. Um, this leads to Eterna. Uh, okay, so then we go to next. What, this is the uh, apartment. Just looking through your memory, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is this? Do, they, do these guys give me anything? No, so this is nothing. Okay, so apartment is nothing. Wait, this is, dude, this is actually crazy though. That kid gives you a master ball? Oh my God, no way, real? I wonder what happens with the underground. We'll have to we'll have to find out. The bike shop. Oh, wait. The bike shop is the other end of Jubilee. So if we actually head down there, we go back to Jubilee. Right. That's the uh, bike path. Need bike. Yeah, it's the entrance house to Jubilee. So the bike shop leads to Jubilee. It's like a one way right now. So it's one way without a bike. So we found the loop if we want to go back to it at least. <laughs> right? So that this goes to Jubilife. And then the entrance house bike path means bike to Um Eterna. Yeah, there's, there's two bike gates, yeah. But that one's, like, I remember the, the NPC from that one. All right, the underground house here. Oh, Frozik, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Leads to can oh. <gasps> no! <laughs> okay, all right, that's a one way. That is a one way. <laughs> I thought we were back with the loop. We're not back with the loop at all. Oh, boy. Okay, 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 okay. So, Eterna's... It wasn't the bike shop. It was the uh, underground house. Leads to Kenilave. One way. And then um, the Darkrai house leads to Eterna. 
Well, we can't go back. Okay. Interesting. Let me save here. Because we haven't saved in a hot second. I don't get, like, soft locked or anything. Okay, so then the PC in Cantilave goes towards Sunny Shore. Okay. Um, I will write that down. As if I wasn't going to already. Interesting. Um, Sunny Shore and then the Sunny Shore Rock Climb House leads to Cantilave. I don't have rock climb though, so I can't get back here. This is so cool. Chat, how cool is this map randomizer? Especially with platinum. Oh my god. No point temple. Oh. Alright, so this is a one warp. This is nuts? Dude, this is crazy. Platinum is huge! I was like. Like, I was legitimately like, okay, cool. We can, like, do this in, like... I was like, yeah, sure. We can do this in, like... I feel like... Um... Oh, I can't actually do that. I don't have... I don't have strength. That's blocked by strength. Like, I was like, all right. I can do this in, like, one stream. And I'll do... I'll do, like, uh, Age of Calamity tomorrow. And then on Wednesday, I'll do a race with this. Like, I don't... I don't... Races might be too long. Also, I don't think we're going to finish this today. Unless we get really lucky. Um, okay. So, this is... I need to write down where we went. So, let me let me backtrack real quick. It's an insanely bigger game than Emerald. Yeah, I, I didn't even realize that. Jared Dry, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Imagine you getting the counter for Reg Regigigas. We can, actually. Okay, so this leads to um, Snow Point for now. So I'll, I'll leave that right there. You're not completing this in one stream? <laughs> not with that attitude. Yeah, probably not. So, chat, do I... Uh... Yeah, it's 10 times the size of Emerald. Do I stream this tomorrow as well, or do I stream it like on Wednesday? Because if I stream it tomorrow, I'm also streaming it on Wednesday, too. Like, it's just going to be, like, three days of Pokemon Platinum map randomizers. Which is fine. I'm down with it if you're down with it. We'll try to see how far we can get today, though. Oh, hello. Move that doubles in powers. The Pokemon's poisoned. Uh, Alright, so you just give us a sod. Okay. Yeah, all day. I, today's pretty much like Pokemon week, right? Because it's Pokemon on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Maybe Thursday as well. And then Friday, Saturday is BDSP. We're going to be in Sinnoh all week. Apparently. That's <laughs> that's crazy. Okay. So this is Route 206. Okay. This is Route 206. This is still a one warp, though. This is still one warp. Good to know that this works, though, too. We're also run. This is so cursed. We're running on this. <laughs> I feel like, like this is cursed. Who's the pixel links to the Prime Gaming? Um. All right, so we got the highway here. We love Sinnoh. Sinnoh is, like, if you have to, if you have to do a week of Pokemon streams, I feel like Sinnoh is the one you do. All right. So this is like, so that's like a one warp. The Mount Cornet, okay. This is also a one warp. Right? So currently, currently it's still one warp, right? So it's it's like, um, there's nothing that like, we've seen that branches our path currently. All right, we might actually die here though. But we can always get back. Like if we die, we can get back. Nice. We should heal. I don't have. We don't have a Pokemon Center to heal at. Oh, what? No way! You have the key. Locking the door is meaningless. I'm the loser in this. After all, there's no time for self pity. Oh, this is. Wait, is this the? Is this the HQ spot? Um. Oh, we didn't have to battle you. You just did something you don't even know the magnitude of. 
Oh, this is Valley Windworks. That's what it is. Wait, what did I just do? Yeah, this is Valley Windworks. So I just I just skipped Valley Windworks. Okay. Oh! Okay, so this does nothing for us. Right? Windworks is a dead end. Yeah, Windworks, Windworks is a dead end. Also, hey, chat, if you guys are liking the stream and you haven't followed the stream yet, uh, feel free to follow the stream. Um, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> wait, is this like... Is it, is it not like a, a two-way here? Is this like a one-way or is it like a bug or like, I'm curious, I'm curious. Is this something that needs to be fixed is what I'm asking. Or is this like a legitimate thing I gotta, I gotta worry about for later? Uh, two Turtle Isaac and, and, and uh, uh, Lu, uh, Luma and everything. It's pointless, I mean, we're gonna die in a second. Is it because of plot? No, I don't think it's a plot. Uh, I told you so this has been, uh, oh, those are the overlapping coordinate warps I mentioned. Okay. So is this gonna be permanently in the in the randomizer or we're we gonna fix this for later? It totally, totally okay if it's either or. Uh, I just, I'm literally just curious. Uh, just so I can like be aware of it for later. Yeah, so it makes it, it goes to spear pillar, which is like what we want, yeah, yeah. We're gonna lose here. Have fixes ready? Okay, cool. Don't worry about it. Um, totally fine uh, so far because we're gonna lose this fight for sure. Um, like, there's no way we're winning this fight. Shout out, by the way, once again, shout outs to the mod team at Sinex Luma and uh, Turtle Isaac for not only making the mod but also being in stream to help out with uh, issues since we have them. Yeah, there. Thanks, guys. Uh, okay, so this brings us to. Oh, what? Wait, wait. It doesn't bring you outside of the Pokemon Center. It brings you to. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then this. Okay, where are we? Oh. Why? Wait, 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 I'm confused. I'm confused. Um. Oh, okay. This is what happened. This this is what happens, right? So I healed last at the Jubilife Pokemon Center. But or, or, no, sorry, sorry, sorry. This is the, the I healed last at the Orberg Pokemon Center, right here. So this is Orberg. Like this is Orberg. However, when I went to Orberg for the first time, I used Teleport, which spawns us outside of the Orberg Pokemon Center. Oh. Okay. So it's different from Emerald, where you faint and it puts you outside of the Pokemon Center. It puts you inside of the Pokemon Center in Gen 4. That's why we got to Jubilife. That makes sense. So, so if I did this, if I want to go back to where we were before, then I teleport to the Pokemon Center and teleport to outside the Pokemon Center. Because the inside and the outside have different warps. Oh, Lord. Um, okay, so we haven't checked uh, Ravage Path yet. So we might as well do that right now. Remember what the other PC is? Yeah, same. Oh, maybe we should... Wait, because that's where we get... Uh... Is that where we catch... Um, Dialga Palkia? No, 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 because you don't do that. Wait. I forget, I forget in Platinum. Spear Pillar. The first time you do Spear Pillar. Do you, like, if you actually, like, do it, it leads to the Distortion World. Which could be another... <laughs> I don't know if it's another warp or what, but... Um, I should write that down. Okay, so up Mart House in Canalave led to all all of that led to spear pillar i'll just say spear pillar but yeah uh thanks for all the follows guys we just uh we actually um it was actually really cool uh we reached um 
the uh, um, uh, 300,000 followers on Twitch, which is a ton. We also recently got 800,000 on YouTube, like within a couple days of each other. So, thanks guys. Pretty cool. I appreciate that. Thanks for thanks for following the streams. Thanks for enjoying it as much as you guys have. I noticed 800k today. Hey, the goal is a million by the end of the year. Is it going to happen? Uh, it's well, it's that's gonna be really hard. But like, we'll try. <laughs> Uh, or at least, at least early next year. <laughs> Tons of fun though. Uh, and if some people are coming from Twitch, right? Uh, some people are coming from Twitch. Uh, this, you cannot get this map randomizer anywhere until my YouTube video comes out. So when my YouTube video comes out, uh, you'll have full access to doing this yourself if you'd like to. Um, Jubilife TV, blah, blah. We got the fashion case. Nice. Okay. So all of this is a story that you unlock. Correct me if I'm wrong. We can only do this once we have, um, once we have the first badge. Am I correct about that? Like we can only do that event if we have the first badge. There's like a lot of story stuff here. Yes. Okay. So we actually can't access Ravaged Paths warp turn back of course it's turn back cave why wouldn't it be turn back cave everything in their goddamn mother is turn back cave it all leads back to turn back <laughs> all roads learn <laughs> oh it stops saying cack stop <laughs> It was a mistake. It was a mistake. All right, yeah. So in Gen Three, all roads lead to uh, Rustboro, but in this, all roads lead back to uh, yeah. All roads lead back to turn back. Wait, whoa. Okay, this is good to know. So if you have the first gym badge and you do that event, then it actually unlocks, like they assume that you already have visited the trainer school. So then they actually allow you to go into Jubilife TV now. Oh, okay. That's actually so sick. So is this pass? Yeah, so this leads to Pastoria. So this goes to Pastoria and then Pastoria, um, the right gate goes to Jubilee. Um, let's check out this. What's up, Arex? Working for Platinum now? Yeah, we just we. This is the beta test that I have for Platinum. Um, I saw you playing uh, Emerald. I hope you uh, enjoyed. Okay, so Pastoria. This is the lonely house, like I like to call it. What do you give me? Wait, repels are useful. All right, so you give me nothing. Oh, you're a free heal. Okay. Um, I'll just put free heal. Uh, if we ever need like a pseudo Pokemon center, I'll take it. All right, then Safari Zone's next. The Safari Zone's actually the Safari Zone. Okay, right, right, because it would break the game otherwise. Okay, so good to know that I don't have to include Safari Zone. This is, this is, um... <laughs> this is currently where we're at. <laughs> uh, with, uh, with doing this, so... <laughs> oh boy! We're slowly filling it in. Okay. Sorry, that. <laughs> sorry. What? <laughs> okay, all right. The, the focus center goes to a focus center. All right, so the Pastoria focus center goes to Floroma Town. Uh, and then this, the PC in Floroma goes to Pastoria. That was like some whiplash, yeah. That's a lot to do. So this actually doesn't cover, I've, I've now discovered this. This doesn't cover Jubilife TV, the Solcyon Caves, or the post game 
and also the like 60 different warps we have, or the 30 different warps we have in Turnback Cave. So, yeah, Platinum's big. <laughs> I made this last night. I was like, all right, I'm going to predict everything here. And then I predicted absolutely none of it. Oh, yeah, Ivy, thanks for the four months. Okay, so then next I got to check out uh, Lonely House, Cheap Life, Jim. Oh, yo, what's up? Hey, really you're out of luck. Crash your wake uh, has gone off to Veilstone. Oh, so we actually have to... Oh, so we don't unlock this warp until we can go to Veilstone. Or... You have luck, though. I mean, it's gone off to Veilstone. Practice match with Veilstone's gym leader. Yeah. Isn't it 120 turnbacks? I think it was pseudo-random or something. Uh, I forget what it was. Wait, I already tested this. This is the vent house, right? This is Jubilife? Yeah. I was like, well, that's crazy. That was, that was nuts, man. So you go to Veilstone until you beat the gym. Right, okay. So I need to go outside of Veilstone's gym. Or beat the gym. And then and then we'll have it unlocked. Okay, good to know. Uh, Veilstone is which gym? It's not Heart Home. Uh, Veilstone's the fifth, fourth gym? Fourth? No, third, third. Sixth gym. Fourth gym. Oh. We do know where the fourth gym is. So we beat the first gym. We do, uh, And we know where the fourth, fifth, and seventh gyms are. Yeah, yeah. So we found the gyms already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, all right. Next. What is Oh, this is just like, okay. Um, I'll go in there in a second. I just wanna make sure this is the house I think it is. Um, this is the Upmark house, right? Okay. Oh, uh, this is Iron Island. Cool. <laughs> nice. We get two warps from this. We do all the gyms today. We're gonna try. We're gonna, we're gonna try to see how far we can get today. Whether or not that's very far, we'll figure that out. But um, so far, it seems we're doing well. We just turn back cave is a lot, okay? <laughs> okay, so it goes to Victory Road. Okay, so that goes to Victory Road, which we are technically prepared for because we do have Griltina. But uh, we'll figure that out later. Oh, and then Pokemart. But does it tell us where the Pokemon is? It does not. So it's, this is interesting because Gen 4 doesn't give you the information of what Pokemon you just saved in. Or what Pokemon you last, like you last visited. Is that a bug? No, I don't think it is. I think it's how Gen 4 works. Save menu gives you city. Wait, does it really? It does! If you open up the save menu, it gives you this... Wait, that was such a... Chat, that was such a good idea! Oh my god! Yeah, in the upper left, it tells you what city you're in. That's a such that's such a nice trick. Yo! Oh my god! Thank you! Wait, who was the one I read? I want to I wanna shout out the person who actually did. It was Mimi Jester, is the one that I, I read. Uh, and, and Goosey yourself. Mimi Jester and Goosey yourself. Shoutouts to you guys. Holy shit. Um, okay, so we got Victory Road uh, and Eterna PC. Um, and we came from here. Okay. Now what's down here? Um, Poketch. You're a trainer, blah, 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 nature's, doesn't matter. Okay, so you don't give me it. You ever find a town map? No, I do not have the town map. Town map would be easier to do, but uh, this is later. Oh, and then survival area. Okay, so survival area, we gotta do later. But if I recall, going through the PC here, Puts us to Solcyon Ruins. Yeah. Okay. 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 
All right, now we've closed the loop again, so we can go back to where we were. Okay, it's a one way. <laughs> it's good to know. That adds. Yeah, you know, I guess we're not members, you know? <laughs> Gotta be verified first, you know? Apparently everything these days you need to be verified to get in. <sighs> Jesus, you know, if only, if only, if only I could be verified. <clears throat> Twitter, please, man. Please. <laughs> I don't ask much. Okay, so this goes to, this is the rig the original Solcyon Ruins. And original Solcyon Ruins goes to survive. And Celestic Town. So we actually go to Celestic Town from here. Yeah. Um, we can't go to Eterna from here though. Although we can teleport to Eterna. Um, yeah. Yeah, we can teleport to. I want to do Eterna first. Uh, what? Okay, that. Okay, that's a bug. Okay, I should be able to use teleporting. Le uh, Leaning Sore, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Uncle Liam, thanks for tier one. What's Crow's Twitter? Is that point, Crow? All right, so... Solcyon. Wait. All right. Celestic goes to Solcyon. Okay. So select... <laughs> That's kind of cool. Celestic PC goes to Solcyon. Um, and then Solcyon PC goes to Celestic. Wait, I can't find my own notes. Where's Solcyon? Uh, goes to Celestic. Okay. Sorry, it's taking me a little bit a while to like do all the warps here because I gotta like remember where everything is. Is it? How do you Solacyon? It's Solacyon. Is that how you do it? If you enable an M map like we did? Okay. Good enough though. So upper left house. Goes back to snow point. Um, let me see if we can actually do this. Let me save first. I know we haven't been a turn back in a while. That's that's menacing. Um can we go through this without needing rock smash? Yes, no, yes, we can. Okay. So we're currently in the upper left house. Wait, level 50 Zubat? We're already over leveled? Oh my god, it's a turn back. I swear to god. Okay. You haven't been to turn back in a while. You jinxed it! You jinxed it! That's all you! Jesus Christ. Okay, upper left. Um and Celestic leads to turn back. Eventually, we got to explore turn back, guys. It's eventually. Is that where you can find Regigigas? Yes. All right, so we go to the cabin now. Wait, does the cabin also... Wait, the cabin also leads to the same... Wait, okay, wait, wait. Wait, that's... 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 No, Valley Windworks. Yeah, yeah, wait, we've been here before. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. We've already been here, haven't we? That was, uh... Where did we discover this before? Oh, Reggie is level one, right, right. But like, where did we enter this? This is where you died to build pillar, but... So I already entered the cabin? No, I don't think I went to the cabin for Celestic before though. So this is like another one that leads here. The double warp cave exit. What do you mean double warp cave exit? Has two origin? That's the same one. No, I know I did. Oh, there's overlapping coordinates. Right, right, okay, okay. So, um, I'll write it down anyway. So the cabin leads to spear pillar. Okay. Didn't I write down Spear Pillar somewhere else? 
No. This was the one. I don't think I did write Spear Pillar down. Okay. Oh, there's four play there's four warps that lead here. Okay, good enough. Okay. Um I can teleport out, right? Just in case. Yeah, I'll mark it. I mean, like, I've marked it as, like, I, I think I, I'll just know that it is like that. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. So I'm very, I'm being very analytic here. I'm not, I know I'm not telling stories or anything, uh, but it's just, like, it's, it's, I, I want to make sure that we, I know what's happening here, you know? Uh, I think we can actually win this fight totally. Wasn't the last time after the highway? I think it was the highway. We'll figure that out later, though. Okay. Yeah, right, right, right. It's more built and everything. Yeah, look at this! Please tell a story. Once upon a time, there was a streamer. Uh, and then you watched the streamer. And then uh, the streamer said to use your Twitch Prime on the stream. And then you used your Twitch Prime on the stream. And everything was good. The end. Good story, am I right? That was pretty. That was pretty good. I I I want to say that was pretty good. I, I I'll I'll take it. Um, this isn't working well. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I forgot how stupid Bronzor is in this gen. I'm gonna need to fi finish Distortion World without strength. Yeah. In that case, I think I just teleport out. How's the sound, by the way? Is it good when I speed up? I don't want to be too annoying when I speed up. It's fine? Okay. OG Diamond Pro Platinum are so slow. They, yeah, I, I didn't realize, but like the battles are very slow. I could do like set and not set, but it's probably fine. I'm gonna play the remakes. I will be playing the remakes and you are not ready for me playing the remakes. I'll just say that. We got we got a little fun uh, fun experience that you're only going to see on twitch.tv slash point crow. Oh, it's normal type, that's why. Oh my god, wait, are we actually banking on the fact that okay. <laughs> fuck! Oh fuck! Don't talk to Cynthia after the Sire's cutscenes. The distortion world is a ticking time bomb that you shouldn't go near. Okay, good to know. All right, so <laughs> we don't. So <laughs> we're not, we don't go to the distortion world because it's going to kill our game. Good, good to know. I just I was curious. I just wanted to know. It was a good. <laughs> uh, right. This is the Iron Island stuff, right? And this is survival. No. Oh my god, I did it again. I literally did it again. Okay. We can get back there if we go through the cabin, but I think we're fine otherwise. Um, Chat, quick question. Let's say you're also using the Zimbabwe and DS, right? Assuming that you are using the Zimbabwe and DS, is there a way to change what time it is through your Zimbabwe and DS. <laughs> do, 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 do you know how to do it? But no, no, but like not just change my, without changing my own PC's clock. <laughs> Sorry, I only have a Turkish DS. Oh shit. Is it there a way to disable your computer clock? <laughs> if you if you know, uh, no, I don't want to change my my PC's uh, clock settings. Cloud Nixus, thanks for the two months. Isn't tied to the PC clock? Yeah, but like, how do I disable that? Like, how do I? You know, 
not do that. All right, so upper right leads to Mount Cornet as well. Which we can discover right now, actually. What Zimbabwean DS are you using? Uh, the, the, my DSM, you, D Zimbabwean version. <laughs> right? Nailed it? All right, we're good. Right, I forgot. I forgot that literally, like, in, in Platinum, they're like, I'm going to blow up this town with a bomb. Right? There's anything here, but that only seemed to make him angry. He's saying he'll blow the town up with a bomb. Yeah, I forgot this was like, they would not include this in, in, a, in a Pokemon game now. I totally forgot they actually use explosives in this. And like, actually threaten like, you know, that. All right, so we actually have to battle him. Okay. I for yeah, I mean they do blow up what Lake Valor. What's up, Dan? How's it going? For the what, dude? It's been one year. Confirm C4 usable in game item. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I played a fan game the other day where we had to deliver, and I kid you not, steroids uh, to uh, your Lieutenant Surge. <laughs> Or it was something like that. It was actually nuts. <laughs> Dude, fan, Pokemon fan games are something else. I'll tell you, man. I'll tell you. They're kind of insane. <laughs> I I don't... Yeah, they would never put something like this in a modern Pokemon game anymore. Uh, are you quite the trainer? Yes, I am the quite the trainer. Um, oh. Wait, 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 wait. I wrote this down in my notes. Let me show you my notes. <laughs> you guys are gonna, you guys are gonna love my notes, right? So in my sheet two, I actually have pictures of all of the complicated structures, <laughs> like like Victory Road and everything. I have maps, but then I also wrote down right here where to get all the HMs, right? Like how to get all the HMs. Um, so if you go, I, I wrote down right, and it was right here, right? So if you want Surf, you cure Psyduck, then go to Celestic Ruins. Turns out you actually don't need to cure Psyduck. You can just go to Celestic Ruins here and it'll be all good because she'll just assume you have the old charm, right? Yeah, because I never had the old charm. Oh, okay. So now we have... Wait, we have Surf now, right? Did you give us Surf? No, wait. Wait, I thought she gives us Surf. Does she not give us Surf? Oh, she gives us Surf inside the ruins. Oh, so we don't even need to do that. Oh. Nice. All right, we don't, we don't... That's useless there. Oh, she gave us the old charm? No, I thought we... No, I thought we give her the old charm. Wait, I'm so confused. Yeah, we gave her the old charm, which Cynthia gives, it to, uh, gives to us. And then, and then we walk into the ruins where Cyrus already is. And then the old woman comes in and he's like, oh, Cyrus, don't do that. <laughs> and then, and then she gives us surf. I think that's how it works. I think that, that's, that's, that's the way it goes. All right. So we have, um, a couple other, uh, stuff here. So Celestic Town, I'll put the cave is nothing. Cause it really is. Um, and then we go to Mount Coronet to the left. Should I end the stream? Nobody has two million points. I get a, I get one message every single day. Should I end the stream right now? Because there's at least one liar in chat every every single time I go live. You're like, I, I think it's a good idea to lie about how many points I have for attention. <laughs> Happens every time. Elias, see right through it. It's very consistent, isn't it? Yes, it is. 
It's very consistent. It's funny. Oh, yeah. Well, watch this. Pause champ. Wait, wait. Chat, pause champ. Watch this. I'm pause champing. Okay. <laughs> All right. Where's Mount uh, Cornet Lee 2? That's huge. That's the mall. Because the mall gives us access to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different warps. Oh, uh, let me wait. Let me. So, mall with floor this is floor three. Leads to Celestic. I'll say Celestic. Um, Celestic. Is that a visual glitch? No, it's just your face. Okay. Solcyon Ruins. Cool. Sorry, I was... I'm sorry. <laughs> that was maybe a little bit, a little bit too mean. <laughs> I, I apologize. That's... No, it's... It's not... Um, you're a lovely person. Wait, we, there's a basement floor? Wait, there's a basement floor? Oh, I don't have that in my notes. Wait, I didn't know there was a mall basement. Oh, okay. Oh, which leads to Floroma. Chat, do you guys, would you guys prefer that it actually, I, I don't know. I think I'd rather it be like daytime in game but I don't want to change my computer clock. Is this fine? <laughs> Is this okay? Uh, Floroma leads to... Um, herb House leads to Mall. Yeah, it's fine. All right. Not okay. Change it now. All right. Yeah, I don't even know why I asked. <laughs> Please buy Pokeballs. We should. Yeah. Is this where Pokeballs are? Um, I forget where it is. Yeah, you sell Poppin. Can we see the Zimbabwe in DS? No, it's it's actually uh um illegal to. <laughs> It was weird. The, the U.S. government actually passed a law making it illegal for you to show your Zimbabwean DSs. And then Nintendo said that they would take you down, like take the, my stream down if I also showed my Zimbabwean DS. So. I know, yeah. So I can't show you, unfortunately. I wish I could. I really wish I could. Um, Verity. Wait, isn't this where? Oh, wait. Isn't there supposed to be, um, the, one of the lake guardians here? Yeah, this, this is Mesprit. Or Yuxi, one of them. It's a lake spirit. Oh, I have to do, oh, I have to free them first with story. Okay. What level are they? Level 50 and it's post game. You have to do the distortion world shenanigans. Okay. Which we can't do because we're not allowed to do the distortion world yet. Because apparently distortion world is not ready. All right, Pokeball's here. All right, so Pokeballs are not here. It's the, it's the other one. Okay. Ultra Ball. Oh, let's buy like a ton of them. Or like five. Let's buy five Ultra Balls. <laughs> awesome. Um, We'll take that for later. Uh, just in case we find like RCS or something. Let's go shopping! All right, let me go over here. We haven't we haven't done this one yet. 
Okay, that's useless. Let's go shopping. All right. Great balls are a better deal. True, but no, actually, I don't, I don't know if they are in this case. Wait, which route is this? Oh, wait, this is sur- Wait, is this survival fight zone? Where is- it's, I know it's a post-game area. This is like the volcano, right? Yeah, it's post-game- Yeah, survival area. Yeah, yeah, Stark Mountain. Okay. Okay, good to know. Yeah, you can get Flygon. Wait. All right, wait, let me save here first. Sorry, this this is like breaking my brain right now. I don't know if it's also... It, it could be breaking your brain too, but it's, it's breaking my game. Or my brain. If we go back here, we can just catch Flygon by... Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Wait, wait, you can actually kill us here. I'm pretty sure... Okay, yeah. So, legendaries actually aren't that overpowered in this game. Like, if you get a legendary early on, like Giratina, like, it's actually, like, not good. Dude, I, you know what? I feel like... I could be wrong about this, but I'm pretty sure that, like... I'm pretty sure that platinum races are going to be like a full like eight hours. Like they're going to be long. Two parts, like a two part race. You could do a two part, well, you could do a two part race and like just like on good faith, be like, yeah, in good faith, be like, don't look at the other person's stream or anything, or like, anything like that, you know? Um, all right, second floor. Yeah, plus the game is way more, yeah, it has more areas too, that's crazy, okay. Yeah, they're gonna take forever, that's insane. All right, so then this right here is floor two, so we'll start with floor two again. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. Um, uh, just watch Grill walk into the, the void uh, while I'm gone. Cheers, guys. Turn back.
Oh, we stopped? Why do we stop? Oh, we entered Floroma Meadow? Oh, we're in Floroma Meadow. Uh, Meadow. Well... I can't do anything about that, so... <laughs> um... Is that... Floroma Meadow... Um, that's not Shaman, is it? Is that Shaman? No, 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 that's just like... It's Floroma, right? That's the set... Yeah, okay, okay. So... I don't think that's useful. Yeah, Shaman's Flower Paradox. Okay, okay. So, second floor over here is Soft Lock. So just make sure you don't go there. That's good enough. All right. All right. So then, second floor up here. Entered a different area, which needs the map hair change, and that changed the active script file along with it. Okay. Um. This is Mount Coronet here, and I can't do it because I don't have rock climb. All right. So Mount Coronet, and then I need rock climb. So I'm going to label that I need a rock climb here. A nice purple. Nice. Light white, light right. Thanks so much for the gifted sub. Okay. The same map that the ones blocked by Surf. Okay. It's it's good to know for later. I still want to like write it down. All right. So third floor, we already know for both third floors. The so fourth floor, I don't know. Is it worth it to level up an Abra and Pokemon Emerald? No. I don't think so. I mean, if you want to, sure, but I don't think so. You might as well catch something else. Yeah, I'm playing Pokemon Spreadsheet Edition. Fucking turn. I'm playing Pokemon Turnback Cave Edition. That's what that is. Like, it all leads back to Turnback Cave. Can I get a Pepe W? For Turnback Cave? Oh, yo, okay, so this is new. This is uh, fourth floor number two, which leads to... Oh! A survival area volcano. Um, so volcano survival as well. Oh, sick. That's the Reggie cave, right? I could be wrong, but I think that's the Reggie cave. All right, fifth floor. Why do I have a pickle beside my name? That is a feather. <laughs> that is a feather. <laughs> a pickle? I'm fucking dead, dude. All right, so this leads to Victory Road as well. Okay. So let's go back to Celestic. A pickle, Eric? Oh my. All right, so let's go back to Celestic Town, uh, which should be third floor. So, th so this mall actually isn't great. I'll be real with you guys. This mall isn't amazing. D-Man, thanks for the Prime Gaming. So we go to not that one. It's the second one. Oopsies. Did we get to buy balls? I did buy balls. Okay. I did, yeah. I did buy balls. Okay. So we'll go back to Celestic Town uh, by going through here. You can level up an Abra to imprison Psychic off the Lake Trios. Oh, okay. We had like practically none of the logic for ensuring the game is beatable actually running when we generated the seed. The fact that it is beatable is pure luck. <laughs> That's funny. All right, all right, okay. So, so for like Emerald and stuff, right? There's like logic in place where it's like logically like, Gym 1 won't be locked behind, like, something with strength, right? <laughs> so none of the logic's actually working, apparently. Or currently. Uh, for, like, when they, when they generated the seed, none of the logic was working. So they generated it, and they're like, oh. Huh. You can actually beat this game by pure chance. That's hilarious, dude. That is so funny.
There's no entrance you can get onto the east route. Yes, there is. Uh, I believe there's the Draco Meteor. Um, house, right? The one where you get Draco Meteor. I could be wrong, though. How many gym badges do you have? We have one, but we found, like, three others. Oh, Draco is blocked by Rock Climb. Okay. If it's blocked by Rock Climb, then yikes. Okay. Markio Link, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you. Thanks, guys, for all the subs. I, I really do appreciate it. You guys are you guys are you guys are great. Uh, okay, so where haven't we been? <laughs> Alrighty. Um, Celestic, Turnback Cave, Mount Coronet. Ah, yo. Oh, uh, the regular house goes to Solcyon One. Solcyon One goes to Celestic or Survival. You can get to the other Ravage path from Floroma. Yes, I do know that. Um, okay, so I think we go Mount Coronet here. Oh, no, we can't do Mount Coronet because we're blocked by um, Rock Smash or Strength? Strength. We're blocked by Strength. Check the legendary counters for you. Palkia and Dialga come at level 70. Where do you catch them? Again. In Platinum. Like, where do you catch uh, the, the Diamond Pearl Legendaries? I forget. Spear Pillar. Oh, really? Oh, it's post-game Spear Pillar. And you need to obtain their ores. Alex Set Go, thanks for Tier 1. Um, But is it, like, a separate instance? Like, is it a separate room of, of Palkia and stuff? Or, like, you just walk up to it with an orb and it appears? Where are you trying to get to? We're just trying to find the second gym. You just walk up? Okay. Um, well, I guess we go to turn back cave, guys. This is the only place we have uh, to go to. Closet Otaku, thank you so much for the uh, Prime Gaming. Can I get an Ayaya in chat for that? Fucking weeb. <laughs> I say that as I literally read all of Demon Slayer last night. But chill. Separate instance, but should be in the same spot as the other spirit pillar you found. Separate instance, but should be in the same spot as the other spirit pillar. What do you mean by that? Oh, there. Yeah, wait, what do you mean by that? And thoughts? Pretty good. I liked it. Yeah, I know there's four overlapping spear pillars. But like, if I go to one of the spear pillars like later in the game and I unlock it, is that how it works? Do I have to beat? Like, I'm curious, cause like, okay, this is turn back cave and it's fucking awful. Okay, I don't know where I'm going with turn back cave. I'm just kind of going, you know. Did you fully explore the Solcyon houses? No, I did not. We'll just go right. Uh, yeah, we'll always just go right. How about that? Low lying warp thingy. The game chooses which one is sending you to best on story flags, having the right orb. Okay. So then for Arceus, are we? Uh, are, can we like just not go to Arceus at all then? Because what we won't ever have the Azure flute. I'll always go. I'm, I'm going to make a circle. I'm just going to go to the right always. I hope this takes us to like, dude, dude, what is happening? I'm just going to keep going to the right. That's the left. I went to the left. We're lost. We're so lost. That means we can never do Arceus. Okay. That's not where we can't go there. Okay, I think I see how this works now. Um, I'm going to save here in a new save state. Because, um, yeah, okay, separate instance. Yeah, 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 I think, I think, yeah. I'm going to test this. Okay, so I can't teleport out. Okay, I just, I wanted to... 
I wanted to... I wanted to make sure. Um... That, like, we didn't get hard locked here. Also... I forgot, like... Oh, wait, I can't catch Arceus? Wait, is Arceus not here? No, I have to use the flute. Wait, this is... Wait. When does he... How does he appear? Do I have to beat... I think I have to beat Cyrus, right? Arceus is normally just there. He's supposed to be here. Are you there, God? <laughs> well, I guess there isn't one. Good to know. I can't get, by the way, I, I'm not leaving yet because I don't know how to get back here. <laughs> I'll be real with you guys. I have no fucking idea how we got back here. Like, how we got here through Turnback Cave. Look at all. He only appears after entering the Hall of Fame. It seems the Azure Flute sets the flag for RC Superior. We didn't fix that because we didn't know. Yeah, no, that's fine. That's why, that's why we're doing it. Okay. So we actually need to use the Azure Flute for Arceus to appear. Okay. Because that's the flag for Arceus. Okay, so we can't get Arceus. Okay. Okay, so it doesn't matter at all. Okay, that makes sense. Hey, we're back in Eterna! Yay! We can't get the Azure Flute. Oh, it's a, it's like an event. Uh, yeah. So the, the devs of the the mod will uh will figure that out for later. Next time we do this, probably as a race. Yeah, you get Palkin Dagger by using their respective orbs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so now I mean we're at Eterna, which is nice because now we can uh see what this is. <laughs> Uh, right. You're the young couple with the reservation. I remember that. It's a coin toss app. We still don't have the po uh, the Pokedex, which is funny. We're in a Bulbapedia. Two versions of the Hall of Origin map exist. The Pokemon Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. One is the real location, while the other is a fake copy. The fake Hall of Origin uses Spear Pillar as its theme. It can be accessed through the Void Glitch using Sticky Man's Spear Hall of Origin method. Fuck Sticky Man's Spear Pillar? Method? Sticky Man's Method. That's sketch. Um, the fake Hall of Origin contains no warps or events in no arts. Okay. Um, so the actual map is a fake one. Okay, so even if we had the Azure Flute, it wouldn't... Like, we have to actually use the Azure Flute on the actual Hall of Fame to get Arceus. This is a fake one. Okay. That's interesting. God is fake. <laughs> All right. Um. Wait, wait. Where the, the, okay, so the PC is nothing. That wasn't the fake hall, though. The music was different. That was the real deal because it had the header. That wasn't. So that was the real hall of origin. But it RCS doesn't spawn because you don't have the. You know what? Let's continue on. Let's continue our playthrough. Fuck, it's the one way! Oh my god, did I really just do this again? Did I really just... I lit- I did the exact same thing. Ooh. Oh, wait, we go back to spear- Wait. We're gonna do this again. Chat, we're gonna do this again. We're gonna- we're gonna do like a loop. I should probably pick up that full bat later. Probably, probably a good idea. 
Yeah, I can't wait for a lot of unexplored areas. But if I recall, yeah, we go up through here. This is this is like a long way around, right? And everything. I know we can use teleport to get back to, but I think I want to try this out. Okay. Yeah, you're good. Okay, so... Um, okay, Mount Cornet. So then if I go back up here, we're back at Spear Pillar, right? Yes. Okay, we're back at Spear Pillar. <laughs> okay. For the third time, we're back at Spear Pillar. <laughs> Maybe if I beat Cyrus? I don't know. We'll figure it out. I think it's worth a shot to do this, though. Let's go unlock some story beats. Will this be a video? I don't know. I will figure it out. It's a stream at least. It'll be on the YouTube channel at least. Or like the VOD channel. Understand, thanks for this eight months. Welcome back to the Murder Legend stream. Ooh, that bronze did not take a lot of damage. You have to complete the distortion world for Spear Pillar to change. Okay. And just double checking. Apparently, um, my game breaks. Apparently my game breaks um, after I um, after I do Spear Pillar or after I do a uh, Distortion World. So we'll see how it breaks, though. I'm curious. Is the Emerald Randomizer sub only? It is not. You can access it for free if you just. Um, are a person that exists. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna give up my heal block. Nice. Um, now we just have the per ugly. Do you have a potion? Oh, <laughs> yeah, I have a potion, chat. You are correct. I have one potion. Is that. <laughs> Does that work? I'm gonna stall like this. I think I go first. I do not go first. Oh, I go first! I go first with the quick claw though! Let's go, dude! All right, my Pokemon are tough, all that fun stuff, blah, 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 blah. I'll help you with this. We're fully healed. And now we beat Cyrus. <laughs> We're gonna watch this, because I really want to. Oh, you already have a Giratina? Yeah, well, like, what if I get two? What if I get two Giratina? Please give me a shout out. No, you're stupid. All right. Oh my God, the Lake Guardians. I forgot how cool this cutscene was.
Uh, I forgot the. Does your shirt say intern? Yes, because I was an intern once. So got again. Thanks for the seven months. Oh boy. Wait, let me do this so, so you guys can see it better. So got again. Thanks for seven months. I already said it. Thank you. That's weird. We already caught it. wildest way to play platinum dude imagine imagine like heart gold soul silver in this <laughs> imagine trying to track two regions in six what yeah in 16 gyms <laughs> 16 gyms eight elite four members All right, so I said no. So I'm going to um, save here. All right. Are you ready? We have to chase Cyrus. I'm going to press yes, because apparently, actually wait. <laughs> we also save here, guys. Okay. Apparently this breaks the game. All right, let's chase Cyrus. All right, so Distortion World. Yeah, no Pokemon time, all this fun stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's Guaranteed, no, oh my god. All right, well, we can't beat this. Okay. That's how, it, yep, I see, I see what you mean by it, it breaks. And now we're in hell. Good to know. Now a random guy's house leads to the void. All right. Yeah, so I still can't do the distortion world whether I, I wanted to or not. Okay, good to know. Good to know. That's funny. Okay. So a turn of city, uh, we have the Galactic HQ up here. Which we can't access because of cut. Thud! Oh my god. What the? So this is a turn of Pokemon. Oh my god. That's crazy. We just saw him. That's wild, man. I thought you got sucked into a separate dimension. Wow. Oh, well, I, uh, I, I guess not. <laughs> it's his twin brother. <gasps> God. Okay. Uh, so Eterna, we haven't done Galactic HQ. We haven't done the right of Galactic HQ. So. Oh, nice. This is, uh, goes to Kangalave. All right, so this is the Cantilave one way in Eterna, and there's also regular Cantilave, which is good to know. So this is the left middle house, which goes to Eterna. Nice. Another Cantilave warp. All right, and then there's another warp down here. Oh, 
Let me out! Let me out! Uh, so Lucian is the last Elite Four member, right? Lucian? Lucian? Yeah. All right, so that's the number fourth. <laughs> All right. Well, at least we found an Elite Four member. Yo, there's Cynthia here. Oh, that device you have. It's a Pokedex. Wow. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. This is, we got it. Wait, what the fuck? Why did she give us cut? We haven't beaten the second gym yet. Like, you're supposed to... Wait, wait. Interesting. So you get cut if you beat the second gym. Right? Am I right about that? Like, like you always... She gives cut before the second gym, but you can't use it until you beat the gym. <laughs> it seems like a sequence break, right? Because, like, we saw Barry and everything beforehand. You get cut before the gym, but you need the beat gym to use it. But then, so... Okay. I'm very confused. Because, like, we, we did this whole thing with, Ro uh, with, with, with uh, Boy, with our rival right here. And then we went back, and then we teleported again, and then goes back here again. So then where, where does... Because the first time you do it, like, your rival says this. But then when you go back, does Cynthia give you cut? Is that how that works? Oh, they're back-to-back -back in the main game. Okay, I just want to double-check. If they're back-to-back -back in the main game, then we didn't sequence break at all. Okay. I, I forget a lot of this game. Then for a call, there's a gate over here. No. Yeah, no, there's... Oh, no, there's the bottom gate. No, this, go this leads to Mount Cornet, doesn't it? It does. This leads to Mount Cornet. Yeah, you're supposed to come from the ne left normally, right. You come from the statue, then she gives you cut. Okay, that makes sense. Meeples, thanks for the gifted sub. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you, guys. All right, so this is Mount Cornet. Okay, okay. So Mount Cornet is, leads to the Pokemon League. <laughs> okay, so we're in the Pokemon League PC. Uh, like the one, the one like before the entrance. That's so funny. Okay, so a turn on Mount Cornet leads to Pokemon League PC. So if we want to go to the Pokemon League right now, we can. But yeah, this is the one before Victory Road. Yeah, Pokemon League PC. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm glad we have a Pokemon Center at least. Okay, so then this leads down. Hello? I must bear down and train. Time is unimportant. I have no need for a watch. <laughs> oh my god! We got the analog watch! No! Dude, that's huge! We can now display the current time. Oh my God, dude, things are moving along. <laughs> Wait, the inside of the GTS is red. Wait, yeah, 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 that's so funny. Oh, this leads us to Veilstone, right? Okay. Okay, so so Mount Cornet leads to the Pokemon League PC, which leads to Veilstone. 
Okay, so Veilstone. Veilstone Gym House 2. No, is this Gym House 2 or PC? No. All right, so it goes to GTS. GTS goes to Veilstone Gym House 2. So this leads to a turn -off. Okay. So what does this exit lead to? In the game corner somewhere in the works if you're in for some gambling. Yo, it's Grandma Wilma. Oh, yo, is this Draco Medi uh, Draco M Meteor? Oh. Oh, but I can't do it because my Pokemon don't like me. Okay. <laughs> I guess we're not friends. It really took one from Ludwig's book, didn't they? They're just co-workers. Just like me and Atriox. Just, just co-workers. Uh, okay. What haven't we done? All right, so we haven't done the Galactic HQ. We can't. We did. We have cut though. Let me save here. So we do have cut to eventually do Galactic HQ. What the downstairs go to? Um, I forgot, but I, I recall it was just like a random house. Um, where else have we done in Eterna? We haven't done the Eterna Forest down over this way. Atrox, you mean Brandon for marketing? Yes, you're right. I apologize. Right, so Eterna Forest is different. Trevor, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Oh, yo. Sick. This is the uh, tower. This is Ghost Place right. Yeah, dude, I wonder... How long do you think this would... I mean, we haven't completed it yet, but how long do you guys think this would take in a race versus somebody? Like, this seems like it might be, like, we're, what, three and a half hours in? And I've not marked, like, mapped out everything yet? Ten plus hours? Very long time to turn back cave. Turn back cave doesn't seem too, too bad, though. Although turn back, well, it's like you can get really lost in turn back. There we go. Depending on lucky you get, yeah. I mean, there's probably hard seeds and like easy seeds. Okay, so Eterna Forest leads to resort, and this one is the bottom house leads to Eterna. Okay. Um, I need to do the gate for Eterna. So I need to do the, the bottom gate for Eterna. And then after the bottom gate, we're good to go. Like, then we're done with Eterna. For the most part. We have a Galactic HQ afterwards. <laughs> Very close to pulling out the bag of popcorn while I laugh at your suffering. <laughs> uh, Mount Cornet. Okay. Uh, and that is blocked by strength. When you start a wiki with seeds and rank difficulties and have different strategies. I mean, so far, we're literally just, like, rushing to push out more generations. Once we do that, we'll do, like, um, probably features and all that fun stuff uh, for you guys. All right. So, Eterna, Gate Eterna leads to uh, Mount Coronet, but it's blocked by strength. My little brother thought your name was Point Cow. So every time I see your name, I just think of Point Cow. You know me. Moo! I just love, I just love dairy so much. What an utter shock. All right, we have resort. You have the Northgate, Spring Path, Manic, Maniac Tile, Lake Valor, Northern House, Resort Bar. Oh, I totally forgot about the old chateau. I need to write that down. Right? Because we get the old chateau. 
um, for a a turna, or t like a turna forest. Although I don't think I really need to write down the old chateau because I already know there's already two. Like once you're here, you know you're like there's like three different. Like you know there's like like you're in Eternal Forest. So you know there's three different um, warps here. I didn't really have to write it down. I gotta make sure I can, like what I want to write down is what I want to write down. You know. Um. So the resort bar leads to Eternal Forest. I like the new follower emote. Yeah, yeah, we have a, a follower emote. Uh, Pico Turkey. <laughs> okay, so so we actually can't exit the old chateau without cut though. Um, so I'll mark a turn of forest is like not completed because it's marked by cut. I love, I know, right? Isn't he cute? All right, so this is pool house. Is it? I mean, just look at him. Look at him go. Mary Chrysler. Hello. Yeah, right. You're absolutely right. I'm hopelessly lost. Okay. I am so glad I just saved. <laughs> I'm so glad I just saved. Because <laughs> that's a soft lock. Or I'm not going to... I'm going to be Cornet, but I'm going to like soft lock and then say it's not... You know, just in case there's something there. Actually, no. Because, yeah. I'll do uh, Mount Coronet Soft Lock. And then put it as, like, something I haven't discovered yet. This is how it's looking so far. We're, we're, we're slowly getting there. We're, we're slowly but surely filling it out. Can you teleport in there? Yeah, yeah. I probably could, actually. Forgot about that. I, I keep forgetting I have teleport. <laughs> That's my issue. Uh, the sweet, uh, key, if I had the Poketch dowsing machine. Oh, where is it, guys? We don't need the dowsing machine, right? Like, we, we just know where it is. Where is the sweet key? By the south building. Like, the bottom entrance? Like, down, down, like, over here, right? I'm looking. There we go. <laughs> All right, we got it. Okay, we're good. We're good. Right, okay. With the power of the internet and a couple thousand people in my Twitch chat, we can find the, the sweet key and exit this building. So this is the uh, northern house, which is GTS. I love the music in the GTS too. It's great. Next is six of the fifteen. Yeah, chat is my dowsing machine. Oh my! <laughs> it all leads back to turn back cave. It's like. Like, Turn Back Cave in Platinum is, like, the same thing as, like, Naval Rock. The only issue is that Naval Rock is basically, like, a one, like, it's a one warp. You know, you you go through it once, and then you exit the out the other end, right? It's just, like, it's just extra steps. This one, Turn Back Cave has, like, three every time. Okay. So then, uh, Northern House, blah, blah, blah. The Rock Climb House, we can't get to. Uh, the right of the pool house is this one. I cry. I cry tears of pain. No joy comes from this mod. Uh, and then this one, right? So this is, this is, uh, bottom house goes to Eterna. Right. And then we have resort exit here. Goes to Mount Cornet, which is blocked by rock climb.
Um, or Rock Smash, sorry. Rock Smash. How many gyms are we at? We got one. We beat one gym. We beat one gym. Um, and that's it. But that's okay. Because we found gym four, five, seven, and the last elite form ever. Uh, and then we can't access you guys. We have to... What story beat do we have to get there? A lot of this is blocked by story, oddly. Like, what Like what do we have to do to beat that part? I need to beat the gyms. Right. All right, so there's a couple things here that we can unlock, right? There's the spring path. I think a lot like your first emerald randomizer. Yeah, I mean, like... We've like solved Emerald, right? So if we wanna if we wanna beat Emerald, we can beat Emerald, right? Like it's like it's 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 easy. We we, we know all of the, the warps, we know like what we need for each warp, all that fun stuff, right? We can stop using We can stop we can stop with the whole paralyzed sand attack kind of deal, right? Alright. Um yeah, there's Spring Path. I know that. Oh, please stop with the Dragon Claws. Or the Sand Attacks. Please stop with the... Please. Please. I would like that very much. <laughs> Let me just use Bubble on you! Yeah, take that! Take my soap! Take my soap right to your eye! I hope you enjoy that. All right, yeah, there's Spring Path, isn't there? Oh, wait. What do we need to unlock Spring Path then? Like, Spring Path is supposed to be right here, isn't it? That's post game. It's blocked until after Distortion World again. Okay. That'll be interesting to see how the devs do Distortion World then. Because, like, we'll have to, like, like once you do... Dis the Distortion World's, like, an odd, like... Like, once you do it, you'll have access to more work. Yeah, wait, I'm, I might ask you guys again, like, in the, uh, in the Discord, like, what I'll need. Like, I'll, I'll probably ask you guys for help on, like, what I need to unlock for, like, once, once you have Distortion World, like, what that unlocks, you know? Um, then we have Maniac Cave, which is up here. Yeah, so Maniac Cave is different. Or Maniac Tunnel. Which goes to Victory Road. Okay, good to know, good to know. Bye, it's not an airport. You do not need to announce your departure. Okay, we're never finding that second gym. Not with that attitude. We'll try though. Did you have to set Distortion World early in the rando have access to everything? Yeah, you'd have to beat Distortion World early in the randomizer to actually, like, unlock everything, like, all of the warps out there. But it's interesting, because I don't think, like, it's still, like, this is still beatable without it, you know? All right, so then we have Northgate here, which is the bike shop. Oh, but we have to unlock the... Okay. Once again, this is so weird because a lot of this requires story progression. Okay, so I have the bike shop, but I need to access the story in the Galactic HQ. Interesting. Yeah, the Eterna Galactic event. Yeah. Okay. So Northgate is bike shop. And I'll label that as green with all the others. 
Yeah, so we actually have to complete a lot of the story. This is way more complicated than Emerald. And we have now done everything we can in the resort. All right, so let me do this then. Right, the last PC wasn't the Eterna PC, it was the Pokemon League PC. I, I remember, I forgot of, uh, forgot about that, you know? Uh, cool, 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 cool. Okay, so we have this. So the PC leads to uh, the old shop, so nothing. I know the Victory Road exit leads to Jubilife. Hey, Ju- you know, Jim 2 could be here. Okay, we're, by the way, we're out of the loop right now. We are totally out of the loop. Um, so Victory Road Entrance leads to Snowpoint City. We have yet to see Snowpoint. So this leads to Pokemon League. Wow. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, I'm going to save here. You can't enter Temple Door until post game. So I can't enter Temple Door until after Spear Pillar. Is that correct? So I have to beat Spear Pillar as well to get the temple. No, after the sin. Oh, after the Pokemon League. Pokemon League. What? <laughs> we have to disappear. This oh, right, right. This is post game stuff. Wait, this is Stark Mountain post game. Ha! Oh, wait, 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 wait. If we enter this part of the game, we're just we immediately get a battle. Level 58? I don't think I can do this. I don't think I can do this. Oh my god, because we're confused, we're paralyzed. At least I'm healed, though. We could have had Arceus. Right, so that goes to Mount Cornette. Right, right. But let me do this, actually. I kind of want to go back to Snowpoint. So if we go back to Snowpoint, we teleport here, right? And then we go back to Pokemon League, and then we head back through Victory Road entrance to Snowpoint, right? So Mart is interesting, because the Mart in Snowpoint is Stark Mountain. And I'll put that as, like, unexplored. Yeah, so we can get back in the loop as long as we die. That's good to know. All right, so where's the gym? Trophy garden? Wait, isn't this the pal park? No, no, no. This is, wait, no. Trophy garden is the, uh, it's the mansion. Which is, which, like, gives you, like, a Pikachu. There's, like, Pikachus and stuff in the, in, 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 behind it. So I'll say that's nothing. All right, so we'll do that. Okay. Oh, God. All right. So the Pokemon Center is <laughs> Turnback Cave. So the thing, the good thing about Turnback Cave, though, like, I know it's like, like, we're memeing on it and everything, but at least it's like an exit, you know? Like, we can always exit, like, as long as we have a, a place to Turnback Cave, we have a link to the rest of the world. Mostly, you know? <laughs> at least, at least we have an attempt at that. All right. And then we have the temple, and then I have the, uh, oh, the right snow house goes to, I'm messing up my rights and lefts. All right. Pokemon! Um, and this is the Orberg City Pokemon. Cool. So, if we use an escape rope, 
and it, it works. Like, if, if you enable escape ropes everywhere, if you use an escape rope there, you'll be able to um, go back to Orberg. Right? I could be wrong, though. Well, no, no, it's last outside place, which would be Snowpoint City. So, no, we wouldn't be able to. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, I can't... There's a couple things I can do with Snowpoint. We can head back all the way down the mountain to go to, like, Mount Coronet. And, like, that one house. And we can get HM... Uh, the HM for Rock Climb, actually. If we go down this way. Uh, I'm going to save again. Yeah, we can get the HM for Rock Climb, which is kind of huge. Where's the gym go again? Uh, the gym goes to nothing. Uh, the, I think it's like the outside of the, the mansion or something. Yeah, Rock Climb will be big. Although Rock Climb is probably the easiest uh, thing we can get to, you know? Brez, thanks for the uh, 50 months. Did you know that a penguin is allergic to different types of snow? I did not, and that's actually kind of cool. Hey, Grill, what, you finally come along now? Way too slow. Yeah, I, yeah, I know. So we need to beat Gym 7 to use Rock Climb. God damn it. Dude, I'm, if I'm imagining, like, a, a seed where we did not pick up Giratina, that sounds like hell. Because we do have, like, a level 50 Pokemon, so we can, like, access some stuff like this. But, dude, imagine we didn't. We'd have to level up our, our starter Pokemon. We wouldn't be trapped, but like, we'd have to level up our starter Pokemon. That sounds insane. You have to catch one of the level 50 gold bats? Yeah, next time we're there, remind me, chat, to catch one of the gold bats. Because it's, it's literally better than the Giratina we got. Although, I guess like Arceus and stuff, if we could get, if we could have gotten those, that would have been beautiful, you know? We got Black Level 1, we beat it from the bot channel. Which was cool. We, like, if anyone's curious, we beat Pokemon Black with only level 1 Pokemon. Nice. Rock Climb! Um, all right, I'm gonna save here again because we did get that. Hail. The next thing about this randomizer will have to include like Azure Flute and Oak's Letter. Yeah, the devs will figure it out. I'm sure they will. Okay. So the left's. Wait, there's two houses here, aren't there? All right, wait, is there one house or two houses? Yeah, one's top right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like one over here. My main takeaway from the black one run was sack deer. You're not wrong. Okay, so... Oh, I did this wrong. So upper left house is Pokemon League. Upper right house is Mart. And then... Where did that lead? Turnback Cave? It, it led to Turnback Cave, right? Have you met, uh, got any gems? Yeah, I, I've gotten a, a couple gems. We found a couple gems, but we're looking for gym number two currently. And the Platinum Randomizer is not going to be available until I make a video of it. Oh, whoa. Oh, yo, this is the Cantilave stuff. Right? Um, yeah, yeah, this is the, the right gate. There's the snow point. Right, this is Cantilave? But I need Surf for Cantilave. Yeah. That seems slower than earlier. Yeah, because it's uh, um, later in the day. Also, it literally doesn't matter. As long as you're enjoying it, uh, who cares how many people are uh, chatting or in stream. 
That's, that's literally that's all that matters. As long as you're happy it. The view count Andes are are a no-go. Um Okay, yeah, so then we have we have two other things we need to look for here. Right? God, I hate the, the deep snow. Um Will this be made avail uh, available? Okay, will this be made available after you make a video of it? Yes. Uh, just exactly like the Pokemon Emerald stuff. It's just a different generation. Um, okay, so Ultra Ball. Right, so there's down over here. Are you racing anybody? No. No, we're playing it solo first. I know the bit rate because of the snow, like, it hurts me. It's all right. I mean, we're slowly, like, leveling up our, our Griltina, though, which is nice. Okay, we're also burned and hail, and this is not looking good right now. <laughs> if I recall, there's a heal at this this cave. Oh! Wait, who's Maylene again? Maybe we've seen the snow point is where I'm going. Wait, who's Maylene? <laughs> the fighting type gym leader, gotcha. Okay. Hey, look, the bit rate's better. <laughs> All right, so if I recall, we can heal in this uh, in this house. I forgot that we're playing a warp randomizer. Okay, so it leads to Spring Path, but the issue with Spring Path is that is that it, it's not available. <laughs> Right? It's not available because, like, we haven't beaten the game yet. Can I still teleport? Alright, so I'll, I'll leave it as softlock. Hi, Ar 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 Arlie. Hello. Um, okay, so the Cornet House leads to Spring Path. And Spring Path, um, where is it? Where's Spring Path lead to? Masquerada, thanks for the good sub. Uh, it's in Resort, right? Yeah, Spring Path goes to Snow Point. I'll say Snow Point, because it's essentially that. All right, so we can teleport back to the Pokemon League, uh, do this whole jazz again, right? Where we're back in Snow Point City. Hey chat, do you guys want to walk all the way back down? To go to Mount Coronet and check that warp? Do you think you'll be playing the 3DS games eventually? Yes. Uh, we're going to be working on Pokemon Black, White, Fire Red, Leaf Green, Heart Gold, Soul Silver, everything. Um, if I recall, we'll be also... Um, if I recall, we're also going to be working on Sword and Shield... Um, and then, um, Brilliant Diamond, Heart Gold, uh, Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl when that gets released, too. But uh, it's every gen- like, the universal map randomizer is, um, why don't you heal? Because I'm dumb. The universal map randomizer is going to be for every generation of Pokemon. What about Sun and Moon? Okay, also Sun and Moon. It's literally every generation. <laughs> <laughs> you have a Zimbabwean DS too? Yeah, I have a Zimbabwean 3DS as well. It was actually like, it was crazy because after the um, remarkable non-success of the, uh, the, the remarkable non-success of the Zimbabwean DS, they're like, okay, let's try the, um, uh, let's try the, the whole, uh, 3DS, but like with the Zimbabwe again. To see if we can like really, really like capture the market, un like which we, which we didn't do with the DS. So I ended up getting a Zimbabwe in DS, uh, which also has everything else. Is there a Lafia 3DS as well? Actually, I'm not sure. I'm not too sure. Bruh? Yeah, I know. It's crazy, isn't it? Did you do this for one of the side series, like Pokemon Rangers or Mystery Dungeon? Oh god. You joked about not supporting Diamond Pearl because it's vastly inferior to Platinum and is also less supported by hacking tools. 
I don't know how different they are. It's up to you guys. It's it, Diamond Pearl is less of a priority right now. Uh, mainly because... I mean, if we have Platinum, then Diamond and Pearl is less. If we have Emerald, then Ruby Sapphire is also less, you know? Have they reached released a Switch for Zimbabwe yet? Actually, now that you mention it, I think so. I, I think I actually got my hand... I think it's coming in the mail soon. I, I might have gotten my hands on one. I think about it. Yeah. Yeah, they might have. Else there, thanks for the two months. I think it's still in beta? Yeah, it might be. It cost two trillion Zimbabwean dollars? Okay, so like four bucks, right? Like, so four dollars? Like, US dollars. Oh, three and a half, my bad. Three fifty. All right, so Mount Coronet's the last warp we got to check in Snowpoint. Because uh, we haven't done the temple yet. And we can't do the temple currently. But we got to check Mount Coronet. It just takes so long to get anywhere in Platinum. That's what I think I'm realizing. It's it's not that like the, there's, like, there's a lot of different warps now. But what I'm actually realizing now is that there's just so many, like... It's just so, it takes so long to get to anywhere, you know? All right, Mount Cornet. What are you? Oh, nice. Uh, that's the, the, the Floroma stuff. Um, with, uh, Ravaged Path. That leads to Snowpoint. And this leads to Floroma. Platinum's a lot bigger than Emerald teams. Yes. I, I totally forgot how big it was. <laughs> Turn back cape looks different than I remember. No, please. Please do not say that. Say it ain't so. Can you imagine doing all 16 gems in silver and gold? We'll have to do it. Every single generation that we're going to release, I'm going to stream. I don't know if they're going to be YouTube videos because I have to like, you know figure out YouTube videos for them uh, in like unique different ways. Um, but uh, we'll figure it out. Hooker's better than Smollett? Eh, don't say that here. He's his own person. Uh, no comparisons. I'm my own person. Yeah, I mean, you can have opinions, but we weren't talking about that. <laughs> This FYI, and it gets your. All right, Floroma Town. You guys excited to finally do Floroma? It's been a while um, since we've actually done like a, a a totally new town. Okay. All right, so we have the <laughs> Floroma PC goes to Pastoria. Uh, Pastoria. Yes. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Bye, honey. Um. I think maybe later. We'll 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 explore this in a second. All right, so then we have the Mart next. What's the Mart? Oh, Galactic HQ. Oh wait, there's so many warps here. All right, we'll start with the first warp. Uh, the Berry Master. Oh, you're the Berry Master. That's awesome. This is extremely cursed. It very much is, and I'm glad you're enjoying. Um, yeah. So Berry Master, and then we go over here. Oh, nice. Okay, that works too. Have you found and/or beat any gems? We found a couple gems, um, and I've only beaten one of them because we we have to beat the gems in order. The goal is to beat gems one through eight in order. Uh, and we've beaten gem one because we found gem one. We also have Gym 4, and we also know where Gym 4, 5, and 7 are. But, however, we do not know... And, and we also know where the last Elite Form ever is, but we don't know anything else. Are racing someone right now? It would be in the title if I were. Um, I'm beating these guys individually. 
Uh, yeah, whenever this comes out, I'd like to do like a solo run. And then like, and then maybe race. I don't, dude, chat, I, if I race, this is going to be forever. It's like what, we're, we're four hours in? I mean, obviously I'm not like, I'm taking my time with it, right? But wow. Um, Wego Ironworks doesn't have any warps in it, if I'm correct. Am I right about that? Like, Fuego Ironworks is a basic, basically a uh, new Mauville. Yeah, dead. Okay. Okay, good to know. Okay, so the only interesting warp here, there's no interesting warps. Here. So there's there's literally, like, so nothing in the mark, technically. Like, like, literally nothing in the mark. Which is good to know. I'm glad we, like, checked all of that off. All right, then the herb spot is the mall. Your race with Purple Cliff was fun. It was. I'd have to ask if you'd be down for, like, a, a literal, like, 10-hour stream of a race with Platinum. Base Cadet Flower, thanks for the two months. Um. Okay, so we have left Herb House, which is this. Oh, nice. Ah, uh, yes, I am Cyrus, and I will tell everybody that I will rule the world! <laughs> All right, so there's nothing there. Yeah, like a 10-hour platinum race would be insane. We'd be doing it all the time, you know? I mean... <laughs> Oh, this leads to Distortion World, right. Yeah, I forgot. So, the right PC house leads to Distortion. Right, so that's the, that's the Cursed House. We don't talk about the Cursed House. Um... Okay, so we need actually... Oh! In order to unlock this, we need to do the Valley Windworks, don't we? Oh my god, where was the Valley Windworks? Yeah, I do I need to be on the outside or the inside? No, 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 like 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 the like the inside of the It was Spear Pillar from Celestic. Okay. Oh, it's outside. Oh, I have to do outside? Okay. I thought it was like the inside Valley Windworks. Which we could also probably do, right? I assume if you beat the outside, or like the inside, it also makes the outside, you know, fine too. Alright, so you just talk to the girl. Okay. Alright, so now they're gone? Do I talk to the girl? Oh, you're right. Okay. Thanks, chat. Yo, we've got a Pokemon Center. All righty, where is this one? Celestic Town Pokemon Center. Um, I'll, I'll save here. Do you find the interior of Floroma Meadow? What do you mean? Like for what? Alright, so... Oh. Yo! <laughs> hey! The mission is proceeding without a hitch! Whoa! I recognize your face! Wait, so if we do this... Um... This doesn't... Like, Saturn doesn't do anything for us, does she? Or he? Them? They. I forgot Saturn... Saturn's, uh... Is it a Lake Guardian? Yeah, but I forgot like what the Lake Guardian here is for. Diamond's a boy. Okay. Thank you. This part after the bomb goes off. Yeah, but this isn't post game, so I can't. I can't catch. I think it's Azel, right? Yeah. So. Yeah. So that does nothing for me. Right. 
that's cool. All roads, all roads lead back to the CAC. Back to the CAC. All right, so we gotta, next next warps we gotta check out are Windworks, the Eterna House, and the Eterna Forest. Um, right. I'm like, yo, <laughs> or to keep everyone out. Oh, wait, wait. We actually, we can't go up to a turn of forest until we beat Windworks, right? All right. Locked from the inside, no! Oh, I need to get a key to get into Windworks. Okay. So that's why I need to find the inside. I see what Isaac was saying there. Makes sense. Okay. Um... Well, we can go to Celestic, can't we? Oh, what? All right, maybe I'll just go in here and then use it. Yeah. So I just go to Celestic Town, right? And Celestic Town, right? We went, we went like through Celestic Town to find the Valley Windworks. What was that? It was um. Because Valley Windworks was in Celestic for the cabin. Like you guys said. Yeah, Mount Cornet, it's Spear Pillar, all that fun stuff. And then this is Valley Windworks. All right, so if we just beat Valley Windworks right now, we'll be all good. Yeah, so we had the inside work, which is fine. Keep in mind, we still can't get the Valley Windworks thing, but it should open up if we beat this. Right? <laughs> Say goodbye to the Perugly. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, that Perugly messes people up, dude. Literally. Pokemon is not as fun as Zelda? Cool. Awesome. We're playing Pokemon. Uh, okay, sick. So we got Valley Windworks, which means that it's going to open up our path to Eterna Forest and also enter... It's also going to... like We're going to be able to enter Valley Windworks. So we, we get like three new warps because of that. And then this brings us to Spear Pillar, right? What? Because you beat Cyrus now? Does it change? I... I'll just go in here. Fuck it. Where do we get the coin case? I don't have a coin case! You need to step in the spear here and changes the warping. Okay. You'll have to explain to me after stream like how it works. Um Okay, so Celestic Spear Pillar is actually the casino fight area. Okay. Yeah, I talked to Looker. Is he he's not here though. Oh oh he is. Okay. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't give me it. Give it to the coin case. He doesn't give me the coin case. That's a story beat that I don't think we're strong enough to function. Oh, Platinum doesn't have gambling? Really? Can't use that here. Okay. All right, so Celestic Town, back to that. Um, and, hey guys, you wanna just fucking send it and turn back cave?
All right, there's also a Sneasel here. Um, I'm gonna lower it. And then I'm gonna use uh, an Ultra Ball on it. We're gonna catch this thing. We're gonna catch the Sneasel. We're also gonna catch the Bat. Okay. Um... Hard to catch though. Is this hard to catch? All right, well, I'm gonna try one more time and then, and then I'll run. Doodle Dan, thanks for the uh, $1. Street, by the way. Um, all right, what do we name it? <laughs> ah, real hard to catch, am I right? All right, Sneasel. Are, are we literally naming it Sneasel? Got you. Got you. Yeah. All right. All right. Hey, thanks for all the follows, guys. If you guys aren't following the stream yet, and uh, you want to follow the stream, I can. Oh my God. Have I actually been live for four and a half hours? Dude, there's no shot. Dude, wait. This is so much fun. <laughs> Dude, you know it's you know it's a fun mod. You know it's a fun game when you've literally just like I, I have no I I have no idea how long I've been streaming for. Dude, these are just too fun. Empa uh, empathetic taco, thanks for the three months. All right, I went left. Yo, this. Is... Wait, that's weird. Wait, this this warp's supposed to lead to like Jubilee. I am very confused. Yeah, Turnback Cave not only has like 60 different warps, but uh, apparently the map cords are different. Okay. I'm going to go back this way. Yeah, it seems like a, a little bit more of an issue. But that's okay. It happens. Hey! hey oh, Look at that. Ice puzzles. I uh, hope my $1 donation didn't come up as backseat gaming. Oh, no worries. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, okay, so it seems okay, so this is this is actually like okay, okay, okay. So this is why it's a beta test. <laughs> this is why it's a beta test. Um, because it seems like half of the time well not half of the time, but it seems like whenever you enter not a bug, it's a feature. Alright? It's difficulty. Whenever you enter a warp, you have like a five percent chance where the warp isn't randomized. <laughs> the distortion world is actually leaking back in. So it's a feature. It's because I wanted to make it uh more random. Um. <laughs> oh, that's funny. All right, but good news though, we've now unlocked the Valley Windward stuff. Windward. Galen D, thanks for the 14 months. <laughs> You're gonna end up in Johto soon. <laughs> Blame turn back? Okay. 
How does it, if you don't mind me asking, Isaac, how does it work? Like, how does turn back work in like the weird way? Uh, I'm, I'm actually like, I'm very curious. Like, why is it doing that? No, no worries otherwise, but oh, it's locked from the inside still. Wait, but we beat the. Oh, so we still have to do the Floroma Meadows. Yeah, I need the works key. But I can go up here. So I still don't know what work like the Valley Wind works like leads to. Like I I don't know the uh I don't know the exit to Valley Wind works. But that's okay. Fine eventually. Yeah, I think the door is like separate from everything else, which is fine. Oh, we also need a heal. So we have our team consists of a level 53 Griltina and then a level 50 um, um, Sneasel. When you turn back, any entrance you came in will have the correct warp. The others will take you deeper into the cave. Is that, wait, is that? Oh, it's normal type, what am I doing? Wait, okay, okay. So when entering turn back, any entrance you just came into will have the correct warp. The others will take you deeper into the cave. There's this crazy RNG warp logic programmed into turn back cave. You can leave through the warp you entered just fine, but if you ever use a different exit than the one you entered from, the game will overwrite the warps that the randomizer set with the RNG nonsense that Turnback normally has, thanks to the program stuff. Okay. Is it fixable? <laughs> no worries if it's not. No worries if it's not. I'm just curious. But wow, we my brain just broke when reading that. Can, maybe we just like turn off Turnback Cave, like un, like unrandomized Turnback Cave, and the only the only random like location is the Giratina one. Maybe that'll fix it. Like, it, it would have, like, less warps overall, but that would, like, that would probably make it, like, easier on, like, everyone. Or, or, you take Pokemon Platinum and just, yeah, put it in a bag of rice. <laughs> or you can do that. The solution is we're moving turn back. Okay, awesome. Thanks, Isaac. I appreciate it. Claps and chat uh, for uh, Isaac X Luma and uh, and at sign. Thanks, guys, for working on this. I appreciate it a lot. You guys are fantastic. So it is. It is a little. Oh, is this the key? No, it's this. Um. So it is a little like confusing, and there are bugs here. It is a beta test and everything. But hey, there's no worries. We're all having fun here, right? If the game breaks, the game breaks. But uh, hey, it, it 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 happens. We're gonna fix it to make it better, which is why I'm streaming. Which is one of the reasons why I'm streaming it right now, um, because otherwise it would just like take, you know, I'm the I'm the dummy. Well, a dead. Well, I'm the test dummy. <laughs> all right, like I I am the 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 um, test dummy. <laughs> Nothing else. Just just test dummy. All right, so where does the turn of forest lead to? Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, so a turn of house is, what, nothing, I think, right? Um, Valley Windworks, I still don't know. Same with Fuego. Forest is turn back. Okay. We'll, have to, we'll have to do another one of these randomizers where there's no turn back cave as well, then. Cooper the guy, thank you so much for the uh, stuff. Like DMs? You have not DM'd me. <laughs> I like how you put check Discord DMs in chat, and then you didn't DM me yet. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right, let's let's go into uh, let's go into Turnback Cave, and uh, and we'll just like we'll just see what I can do here. Okay. Nice. Oh. Oh. 
right, we'll, we'll, we'll reload from this save, though. Makes sense that Turbok logic is weird. That's true. Um. Okay. Uh, I think I go back into here. Give me one second, chat. Um. So this was um, that. Okay, so Duskstone was right there. Okay. Bum, bum. Um, apparently, um, this... Sorry. Um, the DM was that this gate is supposed to be open. Um, because otherwise, you can't get into the other location. So that gate is supposed to be open because it, it will soft lock or not soft lock, but it'll like, you know, um, and so the Eterna house actually has something and I will be sent a, um, fix because apparently the seed is unbeatable without this. Really? Yeah, apparently the, it, 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 that's supposed to be open, and because it's not open, uh, we need to do this. We got this. All right. Yeah, okay, so I'll be sent to patch in a second, um, but that should be fine. That should be, like, a-okay. All right. All right, between the two crates is the HM for fly. That's why. That makes sense. So it's not the warp, it's actually just fly. Although fly, well, you can beat you can beat the game without fly. Maybe the warp is different. Okay. Um, you guys want to go back to Turnback Cave? <laughs> you guys want to go to back, Turnback Cave real quick? I heard you guys love Turnback Cave. I'm actually so interested in Turnback Cave. Like, I know it's, like, broken and we're going to remove it later. Um, but I actually really like it, too. <laughs> At least right now. At least right now. Uh, just, just based on, like, you know, just figuring this out. But we still have Rock Smash, either. Yeah, okay. Because cause then we go back through here and this is Jube Life, right? Yeah. So it looks like currently. So what I've seen so far. So currently, there's a couple warps in Turnback Cave that are set, like, to be warps. Uh, cause those are, oh, that's what it is. Wait, wait, wait. This makes, more, this makes so much more sense. Okay. So the correct turn back cave entrances slash exits, right? The ones that you're supposed to go through, um, to lead you to the next room or whatever that those are the ones that are random warp, right? Those are the ones that are like, you know, like going to Jubilee, going to all this stuff, but the ones, the, the entrances that are random. Those will lead you only to more turnback cave. But it's randomly turnback cave. Or yeah, so that one is a regular warp that will lead you back. I think this one's also gonna be a regular warp then. Yeah. Um and you um oh wait wait. wait. That Pokemon may be watching over you. Would you like to know more about Mesprit? Of course you wouldn't. <laughs> it's a tale. <laughs> it's a tale that Jedi wouldn't know. Uh, the, the the tale of Darth Mesprit, the wise. Turn back uh, is closed loop. Turn back is not closed loop. It's actually pseudo random open loop. 
it's a Sith legend. That's what it is. Yeah. Okay. So so this is the wrong entrance, quote unquote, right? So because this is the wrong entrance, it'll go back to turn back cave as well. So if this is the correct entrance, it'll lead us somewhere random. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, if it's, it wasn't the correct entrance, so it led us somewhere random in Turnback Cave. That makes sense. Which actually was the ret... Fuck. Yeah, wrong entrance leads deeper into Turnback Cave. Right entrance leads to an actual warp. Mushroom, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Uh, is your brain broken yet, chat? How's your brain doing? Just, uh, give, me, give me an update. <laughs> Please. <laughs> I'm crying. Do they lead somewhere random or the same room? I'm not sure yet. Okay, so far it's, um, they all lead to literally this room. Um, so far it's literally this room. Is it because you have all three pillars so you always go to that room? Yes! So if I go here, I'm going to go back to Jubilife? Yeah. Yeah, okay. You know what? You know what? <laughs> I'll just go to Jubilife. <laughs> I just need a little bit more Jubilife in my uh in my in my my heart. Alright, so we do have our first gym gym badge, and we actually haven't checked the GTS building. So let's check the GTS building. Because we haven't yet. <laughs> All right, let me save this. The cave has different doors. The doors that solve the puzzle are randomized. The doors that are the incorrect puzzle choice aren't random. That makes sense. Yes, but also because we actually solved the puzzle, technically every door will lead to the Giratina door. So it's not as random anymore because we've actually solved the puzzle unintentionally by doing Turnback Cave and randomly teleporting to the actual correct locations in Turnback Cave. Needless to say, we're removing Turnback Cave. <laughs> like, we're removing Turnback Cave, uh, you know, when we're... Yep, that, that's... Uh, all that fun stuff. Alright, let me, uh, let me save here, because we need to get Fly. I'm gonna repatch the game, so if you just want to pause, champ. Yeah, so, so, when this is public, and the next time we play this, Turnback Cave will not exist. Wow, it's taking a long time to save the game. Is this a 24 hour stream? It is not, but um <laughs> yikes. Alright, so I'm gonna save in, save out. Make an actual save, rename the same file to match this. Um this Zimbabwean DS cartridge. Or rename this Zimbabwean DS cartridge to match the save. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so I've saved actually. All right, so let me um, reload my Zimbabwe in DS real fast. You don't, I just need to just, just restart it, if that's okay. <laughs> uh, don't, don't worry, uh, we're, we're, we're getting here. Uh, just for, yeah, we, you know, we love Zimbabwe. Why is there tape on your mic? Because the mic actually isn't attached. <laughs> It's actually broken. Uh, and so the duct tape is literally and figuratively holding my life together right now. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do this and then do that. There we go. That should work. I'm just too powerful. I literally like took this and then like yanked it. And it just fell off because, I mean, when you have muscles like these, you know, ooh, then, uh, oh boy, you better watch out for your, your mics. Okay. Uh, so we'll get there eventually back. Oh, but we got to do the, um, we got to do GTS. Okay, so GTS. Yo, it's a Pokemon Center. Which one is it though? It is the fight area Pokemon Center. Interesting. 
Very interesting. Okay, so GTS in Jubilife is um, fight area PC. How many badges have you gotten so far? We've gotten one, but we found a couple other gems, which we can't do because we have to beat the gems in order, one through eight. So we have one badge. Okay, so let's go through the entrance. We came through the bottom. Oh, okay. <laughs> so the fight area PC leads to the Pastoria City PC. Okay. Uh, good, good, good to know? Question mark. Okay. Um. So this leads to Mount Cornet, which I think is a two-way. Wait, wait, wait. Dolceon Ruin. Okay. We're just gonna keep going this way. <laughs> There's so many. <laughs> Why? This is the survival area PC. Okay. Um, what if I go down here? We already knew this. Okay, we already knew this and we knew this actually. We actually knew this. Once again, 5% uh, chance. 5% <laughs> chance to, uh, you know, really... <laughs> does not have the same warp. Because unfortunately, uh, our warps are kind of broken. I think kind of because of turn back. Okay, all right. Uh... There's this, doors locked, all that fun stuff. Then we can go this way. Um. Maybe the entire Pokemon, but the entire game is turned back cave. Oh, yo, old chateau. Yo. Same situation as Spirit Pillar, two works in the same spot there. Uh, one goes to the real Reggie Cave, one goes to the fake Reggie Cave that is there if you don't have Giga's party. Okay. If we can like somehow yeah i think you guys are probably doing it right now um obviously but like if we can like make it so you only do like like the one like the real the one that is more beneficial where it's like like you go through that and you go to the real reggie cave every time and the fake reggie cave you can't go to at all whatsoever ever sorry fix nice claps and chat oh boy Damn, dude. Woo! All right, so this is uh, room five goes to uh, Dubalife TV. You playing with Jenny on Saturday? We fixed since. Okay, awesome. Okay. So room four is Turn Back Cave. Turn Back Cave. Okay. I'm thinking of doing another playthrough of this without Turn Back Cave and with a lot of fixes. Thoughts chat. Oh, this is the battle. That's that's the battle stuff. That's that's yeah. That does nothing for us either. That's like the battle Moo Moo Milk whatever. Yeah, good idea. Okay, like like a completable. I don't know. If we're gonna try to see how far we can get with this. So, yo, Maniac Tunnel. What's going on? Yeah. Whoa. All right. So this is Maniac Tunnel. Keep turn back cave as an option. Uh, it, um, I think it just breaks the game though. I, th I think it's the unfortunate part. Is like, yeah. We'll maybe figure it out like later. Um, where we'll have like options of like, um, do it with logic, randomize without logic. You know, do it with you know universal Pokemon randomizer. You know, do all this stuff, right? You know. Was Maniac Tunnel adjusted? It looks like it was adjusted to be the final zone. Whatever you do, which is awesome. Okay. Heart home! We got a new town! Yes! 
Okay. Okay. So the room two leads to heart home. Okay, and heart home leads to the old chateau. So the right PC house leads to old chateau. Okay. Um, I'll go back to the old chateau and I want to see the entrance in room one. But then afterwards, uh, we'll go back to heart home and, and discover that new one. Uh, cause we haven't, the things that we haven't visited, we've actually seen a lot of this. Um, right? Is it possible the leaf turned back with its own logic, but only reminds the actual engines to it? Yes, that's probably what's going to happen. Um, and then like the, the room with, um, Giratina will be also like static. Um, but yeah, 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 yeah. So this is what I, we've discovered so far. So Solcyon, Solcyon. Heart home. Uh, the left and right half of the resort. Candlelight, Pastoria, Sunny Shore, and Veilstone. We haven't seen. So, yeah, we've only found one Sunny Shore, which is interesting. A lot, the map's a lot bigger. Yeah, I also haven't included, like, if we go back to here, right? Like, there's actually, I have to, like, scroll down a little bit. I just scroll down a little bit because I, I haven't included like the Solcyon's like ruin cave stuffs and also Jubilife TV is huge. And I forgot like the mall basement and the first floor uh, entrance because there's, you know, all that. So, that we've seen Veilstone? We've seen it once right here. But we haven't seen like all of Veilstone. Still haven't found the inside of the school. Yes, we actually haven't found the inside of the school. So <laughs> it's really funny because like, <laughs> because we haven't found the inside of the school, we actually don't have the town map. <laughs> Yo, sick. So, oh, this is cycling road. Okay, so that's, so we actually can't, um, 75 Pokemon, we've gotten the EXP share. Wait, what? Since when have we seen 75 Pokemon? Oh, I guess we've battled 75 of them. Exactly. Sure. I mean, I... Sure. Actually, I'll give the EXP share to Printplot. Yeah, exactly 75. That's funny. All right, so the room one, I need a bike. Good to know. Yeah, room one, I need bike. Good to see Eric already got to the distortion realm. We did get to this distortion realm, and it also, well, technically we didn't. <laughs> There's two Giratinas in this game, which I kind of really like. So you can actually have a team of two, right? Because there's one in the distortion realm, and there's one in Turnback Cave. And we got the one in Turnback Cave. And we're not allowed to go into Distortion Realm because it breaks the game. But, like, assuming we could, we could catch another Giratina. Yo! That's huge! Oh my god, it's Riley! Wait, this is Strength! This is HM for Strength! Um... But we have to beat the Hiker? No, no, it's outside. Wait, wait, we need to go... We have to go... Wait, we have to go outside, right? <laughs> I just got the message. Wait, no. Wait, no, don't talk to him. Wait, no, don't do it. <laughs> I'm fucking dead. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Okay. I can't interact with Riley there because I won't because then I won't be able to get strength. Can we make it? Is it possible that we can make it so you're unable to talk to Riley at that spot? Uh well we know all, all, all the old chateau stuff, so. Yeah, just like I can't remember. How south of GTS here for you, Jack? Oh, South BTS. Oh, whoa! I actually didn't know this thing existed. 
Oh, thank you. Okay, what is this? I'm glad, heart home. Okay, uh, so we can go. Okay, uh, heart home, the right of the love house. That's what I called it. <laughs> Goes to Jubilee. Desert Yoshi, yo! One more month until a full year. Welcome back. All right, let's let's do uh, guys, the love shack, baby. You know, love shack, baby, love shack. Um, wait, how did I get to the EXP share again? Uh, I went to the old chateau, which was in Heart Home actually. Uh, and Heart Home old chateau is the right of the PC. Yeah, so let's get the let's get the uh, EXP share, which is which is so cool that we can do this now, right? Because we've mapped it out properly. We can actually go back here. We get dig or whatever, it doesn't really matter. And then we uh, go all the way out this way. We're getting really lucky with encounters. That's crazy. How did we just get no encounters there? I have no idea. And then the, the EXP shares right here. Yeah. 74 Pokemon. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. So it's actually not 75 that you need to see. It's just, it's less than 75 Pokemon, but it gives you the EXP share anyways. All right. Never mind. All right, that was good to know. Okay, wait, so, uh, Kenilav boat is not randomized. Okay. All right, so we have EXP share again. So I'll give this, uh, to you. Pokemon Journey is not about completing the Pokedex, but completing the town map. Our goal is to get the town map eventually. One day, I dream of a world in Pokemon where we are able to see what things look like. One day. Lucinda, thanks so much for the gifted sub. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you. You're super cool. Okay, so the boat for Canelave, Canelave is not randomized. So actually, if we go to Cantilever, we can just get strength. That's good to know. No, 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 no. no. You, you don't have to randomize it. Okay. Um. So let's do hard on PC. Sure. Miss Indiana, thanks for the good sub. Did you say it was again? I'm the move deleter. Okay. Nice. I'll put the move delete. Uh, it's not really important, but just in case we need it, the move deleter is right there. Dun, 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 dun. All right, then we have the left part, which is a Pokemon Center. It's the Pastoria City Pokemon Center. Uh, are we sure it is though? Are we, based on the last one? <laughs> Is it? Because if we go through here. Okay. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Just wanna make sure. That's Mount Coronet. Um and I can't go that way. Okay. So Pastoria PC and then Mount Coronet. And that is also we haven't seen the rest of that. Um, so then we go back down here, and we should be back at Harlem. Yes. Okay. Let's check out Park. Ah, we already did these two. PC, right? PC house. Let's go to the contest hall. What is this? Uh, oh, this is the Poketch. This is the top of the Poketch stuff. Right, 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 right. So this is the Jubilife Poketch stuff. Okay. So what in what legendary encounters can we get here? Cresselia, we can get Darkrai, maybe Shaman. Um, it's Cameron. Thanks for the tier one. 
Um, we can get Heatran. For sure we can get Heatran. Um, we cannot get Arceus. Not currently. Or, or Dialga and Palkia. We can't get either of those. Oh, we probably can't get Shaman then. Um, yeah, we can get the three Reggie. I don't think we can get the um, the Lake Spirits yet, because we have to beat the Distortion World, and we don't have access to that. Yeah. But really not many. Not yet. Not yet, at least. Um, okay, so this is the right of the... Wait. The left of the gym house. I put right of the gym house. I don't know my rights and lefts. If you guys have watched my stream for a while, do you guys know I don't really know right from left? I just kind of guess, and I hope it's right or correct. Oh, God. Jesus. Yo, what's up, Lucas? Oh, the versus secret. Nice. Nicely done. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate that. All right. Uh, oh, we got the dowsing machine as well. Wow, that would have been helpful a while ago. All right, so this actually is useful because this is the Orberg um, Mount Coronet part, and this leads to Heart Home. And so if I go back to Heart Home, the left of the gym house leads to Orberg. Right? The Heart Home. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Can you go to the caves on the bridge? I don't have cut yet. Okay. So Jim leads to... To the... Okay, 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 okay. So to the right of Pastoria City. Um. So Jim leads to... Left Resort, technically. Right? Because the left gate leads to... Um, Pastoria. This goes a heart home. So this is actually like its own separate area, technically. Yeah, we can get Heatran, which is like what, level 70? Or level 50. Yeah, so let's go to the foot house where he checks our feet. I should call this rather than the beach house, I'm gonna call it the foot house. This is the this is the guy with the foot fetish, and he checks your, your Pokemon's feet. Yeah, rather than beach house, I'm gonna look at foot foot house. Thanks, I hate it. Do you guys remember that in Platinum? All right, turn back cave. Okay, so now that we've done the foot house, uh, the resort entrance and then the right beach house. Yeah, so we have the resort entrance here. Oh, technically, I mean, I can write these down, but it's not like I, it doesn't need its full new location. Or anything. Yeah, because we have resort entrance here. Yeah, up here. Yo! Oh, and we, we the, you're the uh, fighting gym leader. Right. Okay. And this is Snowpoint City. Okay, so this is Snowpoint Cities. Right, because she left, and this is where we met her. That makes sense. Um, so the resort entrance is Snow Point PC. I'll heal here. What's your favorite Pokemon? I like Pidgey. <laughs> I also really like Frostlass. It's my favorite Pokemon. Umbreon's also really cool. Snow Point Temple at the bottom. Oh, yo! Statue of Pokemon. One can sense its power. Reggie Gigas. Oh, it goes to Heart Home. Okay. Okay. So. The Snow Point PC also leads to Heart Home. Okay. This also leads to Heart Home. Um, and then this goes to Turnback Cave, which is obvious. Okay, so Heart Home, Turnback Cave. Okay, good to know. 
Um, actually, speaking of Heart Home, let's go to Heart Home. Is Heart Home secretly turned back cave? No, I don't think so. Okay, so this is the, uh, um, this can go to, uh, okay. So the left of the mark goes to snow point PC. And, uh, that's actually, that's all I'm going to say there. Cause that's all I need. Church time. All right. What's in the church? KJ Sunshine, thanks for the one year. Yo, thank you for that. Jeez. And the Glogster, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Church. Goes to Mount Coronet. Okay. Um, I don't have Defog. Okay, so Mount Coronet. Happy Water, thanks for the 18 months. Um, and we'll go down all the way this. Yeah, entrance here. Um, I don't think there's anything else over here. I think it's just one warp, isn't it? This is where Oak's letter, like Oak's letter would come in handy. This is, uh, um, Shaman's area. Yeah, if we had Oak's letter though, we don't have Oak's letter. Would it be, like, I wonder, should, should we make it possible where you just, like, start with Oak's Letter and the Azure Flute? Because otherwise you can't get it, right? Yeah. Um. Oh, and Hotel Key. I don't know if Isaac's in here, but, uh, can we make... Um, all the event items. Um, um, be in our inventory. Um, yeah, it, it'd make it possible to run into more legendary Pokemon. It'd be more fun, I think. Yo. It's not as simple as that? Okay. Um, which Pokemon do we want to catch here? We're going to catch... Oh, the Float Cell. Definitely the Float Cell. Yeah, the Float Cell is what we want here. Nice. Okay. So floats out. What should we name it? Oh God. Oh, I hate that one. Oh, oh, I saw it in chat immediately. Oh, fuck. Fine. God, oh God, I hate it. <laughs> All right, we got Throat Zell. Uh, All right, so I'll put, uh, what was it? The church goes to Shaman. All right, um, we're gonna see if we can make it possible to get all of the uh, um, events for legendaries. We're gonna we're gonna see if it's possible. All right, we're gonna try. So if you get to Shaman like that right there, then you'll be able to do it. If you get to uh, Spear Pillar with Arceus like that that location, like then also you'll be able to get Arceus regardless. Yeah, that, I think it would make it more exciting. Yeah, for sure, sure, sure. I mean, this this is like a, this once again beta test and everything. So, uh, we are testing it out right now. It's, it's good that we're figuring it out right now. It didn't just, like, pop into, like, a race and be like, ah, you know? All right, part two. Here are you. Oh, it's a free heal. Okay. Nice. So, part two is a free heal. Uh, 
Uh, is an idea to have every agent from the get-go as well? Nah, we have logic to ensure that, uh, um, we have logic to ensure that doesn't happen. Uh, so then you, you have access to getting all the, uh, HMs and everything, and, and, like, Gym 3 won't be locked behind Gym 5 and all that fun stuff. Okay. Okay, so we have, we have the Love House now, which I've called it. Um, what is this? Oh, whoa, this is the, this is the museum. Oh, this is the museum. So, nothing. Fine. Could you theoretically find the champion and beat her directly? Yeah, you could. But I think it's more interesting if we do gyms one through eight and the elite fours in order before I uh, finish the game. What is this? Okay. okay, so nothing as well. <laughs> All right, good to know, good to know. Wow, we've really done like most of Heart Home. All right, so we have the gates next. So we've done everything in Heart Home except the gates. Vernessi, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Okay, so we have like this, right? Um, And we can't activate this until we beat the gym three. Right? We can't activate this one until we beat Gym 3. Yes. Okay. So that warp is... We can't get until Gym 3. Alright, so... Then, oh! Oh my god, it's a Baneri! Oh my god, thank goodness! Baneri! Coming from the back! Now, if that was a low punny... Uh, then, then the Lopani would be the evolved form of Baneri, right? Uh, so it would be more powerful, like, of, a, of an attack, yeah. Just saying, in case you don't know your evolution. I got you. Don't worry, don't worry, guys. Brutal Nate, thanks for the two months. Okay, so this over here. All right, we're gonna keep going through this. Which gym are you on now? We are trying to get the second gym. Oh, we need rock climb here. So this is Mount Cornet blocked by rock climb for the left gate. Uh, we do have rock climb, but we, we can't use it yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is leveling scaled? Uh, it's just, it's the same thing as a regular game. So if you, if you're like, start the game and then you go to, um, like Mount Coronet, Mount Coronet's gonna have, like, the regular levels of Pokemon. But Punny are 75% male? Yeah, but that's 25% though. Are female. Is what I'm trying to say. Um, left gate is Mount Cornet. I actually need to go here. Le sorry, South Gate's uh, Mount Cornet. Left gate is. What is this? <laughs> I don't remember this. They're balls. Okay, th thanks. Thank you, chat. Thanks for that. I know this bottom Solcyon. So I got a nug. Oh, these they're all items. Oh, we got defog. Nice. Um, okay, awesome. Okay, so that's where you get but you don't really need defog at all to, to beat the game. It's like flash if I if I'm correct about it. No, I know what the mine plate is. Yeah, mine plate's RCS stuff, but you just need it for a side quest. Okay. 
Um, all right, where haven't we been? Veilstone. How do we get to Veilstone? Gym house number two in Eterna. So how do we, uh, Eterna? Okay, so in Eterna. Uh, we get to Veilstone through Mount Coronet, Eterna. Okay. How do we get to Mount, how do we get to Eterna? We can go from Jubilife. And to get to Jubilife from a heart home, we go through the right love house. Okay. Right, so we go to the right love house. And we get to Jubilife. Okay, so now that we're in Jubilife, we need to make our way to Eterna. Uh, right. Oh, the, wait, the Eterna was a one way. say Arceus like the rest of us? I say Arceus. Is Arceus wrong? Or is Arceus right? How did we get there? The Yeah, I say I say Arceus, yeah. I think it's I think Arceus is right. Yeah, Arceus. Arceus? Okay. Okay, we can all agree, though, that you don't say it Arceus. <laughs> now, that, that's just fucking wrong, all right? Like, Ar I can I can say Arceus and Arceus, but Arceus? Dude, you good? <laughs> okay, all right, so here the gate is nothing. Uh, Poga Club 2 is Galactic HQ. Oh, why didn't I write this down as something we haven't explored yet? What the fuck? Yeah, I didn't write that down as something we haven't explored. Where does this go? Iron Island. Sure. Um. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is the end of Riley's path. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so then we don't want this to exist. Okay. Thank you, chat. Now let's send out Throat Zell. Sorry, it's so funny, man. I'm so funny. It like it's it fucking kills me, man. Can you chat on your own stream? How can I get this ROM hack in your Discord? It's gonna be released as a tool. And it will be after I release my YouTube video of it. Yeah, so it doesn't actually seem to be too hard to get like difficult Pokemon. I think I think we'll have to revise the rules for Pokemon Platinum though. So basically what we're gonna have to say is essentially, hey, you are able to, like, because beforehand in Emerald, it's like, you're not allowed, or we had it, so you're not allowed to, um, you're not allowed to reset to catch Pokemon, only legendaries. I think we'll have to reset it here to make it faster, where you can reset to catch any Pokemon. If that makes sense. I think that might be better. Oh, this is a turn of city, isn't it? Oh, it's Orberg. Well, if I go to Orberg, is, is there something like... 
brings me to Eterna. Yes, it does. Okay. Yes. Okay. So we, if we actually, let me heal first. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Since we're at Ouroburg, this is, it's all coming together. That is all coming together, right? So now that we're at Ouroburg, uh, I can use teleport to go outside of Ouroburg City. Yes. Okay. Awesome. And then I want to go to Solcyon Ruins 2, which is through the Pokemart, which is all the way around here. Okay. And then Eterna should be here. Okay. Nice. So now that I'm in Eterna, <laughs> I go to Mount Coronet, and then that should be where Veilstone is. If we can find Gym 2, that'd be great. Any Gym Tours? Um, chat, question. Um, uh, Isaac has a fix for Arceus currently. I actually don't remember. Do you guys remember where Arceus was? I don't remember where Arceus was. I know it was in Turnback Cave, but where? Where in Turnback Cave? Somewhere is probably the answer. Um, Isaac, send over the fix to me. And then when we find it again, then I'll add the fix. Okay? <laughs> I'll add the fix if we find Arceus again. All right, so this is the Pokemon League stuff, and then this goes to uh, Veilstone? No. This, go this goes to Veilstone. Nice. Okay. So now we're in Veilstone. Will you and Purple Clip do another race? Yes, uh, if he uh, wants to. I'd love to. Uh, okay, so Veilstone. We have a full like I feel like I feel like we got lost too many times in like the the minutia of a lot of this. But Veilstone here. Was the iceberg ruin? Wait. That's your Pokemon. Pay he becomes strong, you must so much that others cannot notice. Wait, how do I do this then? From somewhere, something spoke out. The master, the human in the company of her master, pay heed. From stronger you must, so much the others cannot but notice. You have to walk on all of them? No. That didn't work. Or do I have to, like... Walk on them without. Yeah, wait, that didn't work. Maybe we have to do it like this. Oh, dang. Do I need Reggie Gigas in the party? No, I don't think so. Do I? No. Oh, I need Reggie Gigas in the party. Yeah, in the company of the master. Yeah, okay. I'm okay with... How do you fix that? Like, if you want to fix that somehow, so you can get it in, like, this playthrough, how do you even fix that? I don't think you do. I don't think you... I just don't think you get the Reggies. Yo, what's up, Wake? Oh, I also can't... I think I have to get, like, what? The National Dex, too?
Okay. Interesting. So the gym, you actually need Gigas to enter the map for normal gameplay. That's as much as you get when you don't have the national deck. Okay, so I need to beat the game to get the Reggies. That's fine. Is I don't know if is that is that worth a fix? Like for for the actual version chat, is that like worth a fix? Yeah, you know, like it's it's a Reggie, you know. It's like eh, seems like inconsequential. I don't think we need to. Yeah, we don't have to do the Reggies then. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just like yeah, we can just like not do it then. That's okay. Um, so then we'll call that useless. <laughs> um, so Veilstone Gym House One is nothing. You're removing that check in the final version of the randomizer. Oh, so you can't. Okay, so if you're already doing it, then sure. But you don't have to. If you don't want to. Will this be uploaded to the VOD channel tomorrow? It uh, all VODs are uploaded within five hours, five days of when they go live. All right, so the gym goes to the north gate of the, um, uh, it goes north gate of what? What was it? It's the one with the mansion, Pastoria. Um, yeah, north gate goes to Va Veilstone. Okay. Sick. All right, what else is here? Yeah. Also, chat. Thanks. Thank you so much for uh, helping me out with this, and uh, and and uh, really figuring out this uh, randomizer with me. All right. Casino leads to. Um, craftsman, Caprendo, smells something about you. I can power up your Pokedex so you can read descriptions. Of oh, this is the uh, power up the Pokedex so you can read descriptions in other languages. It's the language casino. Uh, but yeah, thank you, chat. I appreciate it. So casino is nothing. Wait, there's left of casino? Oh, there is left. Oh, wait, there's... It's right of casino. Man, I got my lefts and rights wrong. Oh, this is the herb shop. Okay. So that's also nothing. Or the berry herb, you know, all that, that fun stuff, you know? Okay, so let's go up here. Let's see what the Poka Center is in Veilstone. <gasps> Turn back! Turn back! I hate it. Okay, then we do PC House 1. So this is Solcyon Ruins 4. Okay. 4. Okay. Interesting. Uh, this is PC House 1. So this goes to Solcyon Ruins. Or Solcyon 4. So there's like four like pathways that we've seen. That goes to Iron Island. So iron, which we haven't discovered yet. Hello. Um, Shellos, cool, awesome. That's nothing. Okay, and then the next one is. Oh, the daycare. Imagine putting your daycare. Like, imagine putting your Pokemon in the daycare here and then just being like, yeah, we'll find them eventually. They'll be around here soon. Like, you're going to forget where the daycare is. <laughs> oh, my God. Last time we got to Arceus was a Celestic Top, Celestic top Left House. Yeah. You go through the temple to turn back cave. Then it's left door, right door three times, bottom door three times, then right door, then go through the top door and you're in your art. Wait. <laughs> Holy shit. Wait, let me save this really quick. There's no shot. All right, all right. 
Is that how we got to our dude? Dude, we got it. We turn back caveman. I'm telling you. That's what you did in the VOD? No, I believe you. I think it's hilarious. Okay, so there's Iron Island at uh, Solcyon Ruins 4. Nothing else. Alright. So then, uh, PC House 2. Can I talk to him? <laughs> right, he's gonna give me strength, right? Yeah, okay, we got strength, okay. I'll be inside. And then he... He just... I have been entered. <laughs> okay, we got strength. <laughs> oh, there's a house here. Okay. Yo. This is the first one. First Elite Four. Okay, we're making some progress. Uh, we can't beat him though. Or actually, we probably could beat him, but that's not the issue. We gotta, we gotta teleport out of here. Yeah. Um, all right, what's our, what's our exit from Snowpoint? I need to go back to Veilstone. Go into the tree? <laughs> no. It's not a teleport. The log isn't a teleport. <laughs> okay, we have um, Snowpoint. Actually, we can go to Stark Mountain with the Mart here. Let's try it. Fuck it. I know, but it's the tree. Okay, so we'll talk to Mars and we'll beat Mars. Three Pokemon, level 58, that's fine. Because we also have three level 50 Pokemon as well. Yo! Let's go! Uh, yeah, we're gonna teach you Bubble instead of Bubble. Uh, bubble Beam instead of Bubble. Dude, that was crazy. Uh, I'll Shadow Force this too. Kays, yo, thanks for the ten, the, sorry, five gifted subs. It's very kind of you. Above and beyond. Very appreciated. Thank you. Um, crunch here. Uh! Sorry. Sorry, that was... I was really shocked about that. Yeah, Prugly, uh, Prugly sucks, man. We just, we just lost this, by the way. <laughs> Mr. Dude, thanks for the Prime Gaming. All right, which one are we in? Uh, wh where are we here? We're in the Pokemon League. Um, Pokemon League, actually, if we go down here, it leads to Eterna. Oh no, wait, wait. Pokemon League leads, goes to Veilstone right here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we're in Veilstone. Nice. Wait, sped up is kind of a bop. It's actually, like, not bad. Okay. Um, so PCS2 goes to Elite, uh, Elite number one. It also goes to Cantilever. Because of the uh, boat. Okay, so where does the mall go to? Nothing really <laughs> useful. Nothing, nothing we really, really want to, want to go to. I don't know you guys, but, but you know, where else would it go? You know, you're not wrong, and I, I hate that you're not wrong about it. Was that I missed it? No, you, you missed nothing. You missed absolutely nothing. All right, so... Oh, did I not write this down either? Oh, left gate here, yeah. The left gate is... Yo! Elite number two? 
It's three, okay. Number two? Chat, which one is it? It's number two? <laughs> okay. All right, so we do this, Pokemon League, uh, Snow Point, and then <laughs> we try Stark Mountain again. All right, so it is number two. All right, so we try, we try Stark Mountain again. And see if we can actually win. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Uh, and then we'll do the same thing again. Use Ancient Power on Golbat. Oh, I should do that. I one shot learned it. Yeah. All right. So we have Perugly now. Now you have to use Dragon Claw or Ancient... Dragon Claw or Ancient Power? I'll use Dragon Claw here. Oh, the crit! We did it! Wait, we actually did it! You get wrecked, Brugly! Holy! All right, Jupiter, blah, blah blah. I'll go up next. Wait, wait, wait! No, wait, no! Stop! <laughs> wait, no! No, stop, please! This is, I know this is like one of the final fights in like the you know in the game, but like still. I don't know why I did agility there. I don't, don't ask me. Don't ask me why. I, I guess I girl boss too close to the sun. Go, Abby. Okay. You're in charge, throat cell. Oh my god. All right, all right, all right. I that's it's so weird because we have to like I guess we do the Arceus thing like later if we can. Or at least we make it to Veilstone. Cuz like if we die, like we make it to Veilstone and we can do everything uh, like over again. Right? But it's good that we found the other Elite Four members. Um I did the right casino house and everything. I didn't do Southgate though. So let's check out Southgate. Okay. Southgate's nothing. Um, if you guys are curious, this is what the map looks like. Take a screenshot if you there. Um, but that is currently what it looks like. There's a bunch of stuff that I haven't included yet either. But we haven't been to Sunny Shore a ton. So, interesting. This Team Galactus Warehouse. Wait. Oh, we have to beat the gym, right? Can you do that? Shane the Creep, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Do we have to beat the gym first? Yeah. Okay. Well, we can go up here, and we have three different warps here, I'm assuming. Okay. Nice! Okay. <laughs> Whoa! That's the unactivated Regice room. Interesting. Oh, this is the Jubilee stuff. Um, so... Okay. So Galactic HQ1 leads to nothing. Galactic HQ2 leads to Jubilee TV. Okay, okay. All right. Okay, let's beat it right now. Uh, we have to we have to face the trainers, don't we? Do we finally found it? I can't believe we finally found it. It only took a, it only took you 15 less minutes than an emerald. No shot, really? 
Hey, it's Cameron. Thank you so much for the gifted sub. Uh, the five gifted subs. Wait, actually, though? That's funny. If so, if, if so, that's big. Honestly, we're not really doing much, like, in the way of... I don't know. It seems so far... I said this was going to take, like, a 10-hour kind of race and all. I don't really think so. Like, the more we're playing this, the more we're starting to solve this farther. And it's really, like, it's getting better. I don't know if it's an easy thing or whatever. But, like, imagine Turnback Cave doesn't exist, right? This, uh, we haven't explored Victory Road. We haven't explored a lot of, uh, a decent amount of Mount Coronet. And we're still missing, like, two cities. But it's not as bad as I thought. Yeah, it's going to be better with the outs and everything. You're speed boosting a whole lot? I'm actually not. Uh, I keep not speed boosting because I don't want to break your uh, your ears and everything. Um, if I was racing, my uh, I would be literally speeding up the entire time. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll get fly at some point. Don't worry. Oh my god, Turtwig! I always found it weird how the second gym just has a starter. I don't know. I always just did. I don't know why. It was just weird to me. Nice. And that's the second gym! Woo! Oh, we take those. Alright, so second gym allows us to use cut. Which actually does open up a decent amount of stuff. <laughs> oddly. It oddly does. And then grass not all that fun stuff. Um, what's over here? Victory red. Okay. So are the mod team is the mod team returning? Uh, removing uh turn uh turn back cape. Yes. Yes, yes, they are. All right, I've saved the game. All right, number three. Oh, this is this is galactic stuff again. This is literally one floor below. <laughs> this is yeah. For context, this is one floor below the first gym. If Eric could use the elevator going downstairs about four hours ago, he would have found the gym. Yeah, but like you know, why why? Why do it the uh, the easy way when you can just do it the absolute disgusting and hard way? To be fair, uh, I didn't ha I didn't know Jubilee TV had an elevator. Oh, I forgot it did, so I didn't write it down. So it just makes it so much more like <laughs> difficult to for me to like remember where things are. Yeah, just remember it's about the journey, not the destination. All right, guys. Um, and we can't get this, which doesn't matter. Okay, turn back cave. Um, I'll just put, yeah, this leads to turn back. It all leads to turn back. It basically all of the yellows that you see here are turn back. Um, all right. Well, that's most of Veilstone. So how do we get to uh, Solcyon? So Eterna, f Eterna is how we do it. Can we get to Eterna quickly? Jam House 2. 6AL, thanks for the two months. Uh, so Jim House 2, it leads to Eterna. Nice. What was the Arceus? route again. <laughs> Celestic top left house. Go through the temple to turn back cave, then left door, right door three times, bottom door three times, then right door, then go through the top door, and then you're at Arceus. That's apparently what, what it is. <laughs> we will we will <laughs> figure that out later. Um, let me save here real quick. Yeah, I'm, 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 while I'm here, might as well click 
you know, affect the galactic building. Um, let's teach cut. I feel like, yeah, Prinflup, unfortunately, is going to be our indentured servant, HM, indentured servant. Yeah, I can also do inside of the turn of forest since we have that ready. Fight area. Okay. I don't have fight area, survival area, and whatever the other one is written down. I don't. So if there's like a gym here or something, we're going to figure that out later. Okay. <laughs> uh, where was that? Eterna Galactic HQ was um, fight area. Okay. Oh, can it? You fly in the route uh, to a five house. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Uh, are you beating it in one stream? We're going to see if we can get as far as we can. So far, we have two gyms. The ones that we're looking for is gym three. We know where gym four, gym five is. We do not know where Gym 6 is. We know where Gym 7 is. We do not know where Gym 8 is. Um, and we know where three of the four Elite Four members are. We do not know where the champion is. Are you allowed to use Fly once you get it? Yeah, you might as well. But the thing is, is, like, Fly... Is Fly available without... I don't think we can use Fly without the Gym Badge, right? be wrong um no wait is this not the fix I get the uh oh. <laughs> That's okay. Try another thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you have it, put the RCS. In too. Yeah, yeah. That's fly right there. Yeah, yeah. But we can't use fly until we get it. Yeah. No, I, I see it. Yeah, yeah. Two minutes. Yeah, you're totally. Good. Yeah, let's head over to Celestic Town then. Huh. I'm actually like, I have an idea. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I have an idea. I have an idea. I have an idea. <laughs> um, why don't we do this? Okay. So this was like a good prelim. This was like a good prelim for Pokemon Platinum Rando. There's clearly like some things that we got to work on for later. Um, how about this? So, uh, today we did this. Tomorrow, we're going to do Age of Calamity DLC uh, and, and, and uh, see the new story and all that fun stuff. And then Wednesday, we're going to do another seed with actual logic, no turn back cave, etc. And, like, the legendary is hopefully fixed by then. Uh, and we'll do that on Wednesday. And then Thursday, either we complete Age of Calamity DLC, or we complete the Pokemon Planet Rando, and Friday, we do Pokemon Shining 